show and tell? No, no. <laughs> well, I can show and tell. This is a Moonwood Mill. <laughs> this is Moonwood Mill. There's... Hang on. No, no. Okay, that... I'm trying to... Okay, there we go. There's one lot there. That's a bar. That's a library slash gym. Oh, my finger doesn't go that high. There's a starter home and another home up there. All fantastic lots. Some of the best, you might say, that came in The Sims 4 ever. So, you know, pretty amazing. Uh, let's... So my plan today is I was actually wanting to build on the library, do some renovation there. Because oh, I made them all. Yeah, that's oh, that's right, I forgot. Yeah, I built all these lots. That's why they're so good. Yeah, oh, silly me. <laughs> Are you having fun back there? Yeah, I'm being the... You know in the 90s on, like, Wheel of Fortune? Yeah. How It was very misogynistic, but... Yeah, look, it's not great, all that stuff. But you're doing a great job of it. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, I should leave. I'm gonna leave. Yeah, I, I don't think I'll ever get anything done if <laughs> if I'm just talking to you. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry. I will stop being attention seeking for you. I'll do the background. Okay, I'm leaving. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'm on the wrong thing. That's why that's why I couldn't find the button. And moonwalk. Oh, my butt looks really good. Looks big. It looks, yeah. Look at that. I mean, don't look, but don't, whoa. Yeah, don't look, guys. Whoa. <laughs> 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 oh my god. <laughs> All right, thank you. That was Deligracy, everybody. And make sure to check out our merch at deligracy.shop. Pretty amazing stuff. Bye. Bye, have fun. I assume you'll be back later. Yeah, oh, I will be. <laughs> okay. So, Sims. I mean, Sims isn't really that fun after having Delhi, is it? It's kind of, I mean, that was the peak of the stream, so. Ah, oh, dear. It's all downhill from here. Well, um, <laughs> so what we're going to do, yeah, so I want to, when I built these lots, if you don't know, when you build an official lot in The Sims 4, like, and you're working with the team, you cannot use any sort of cheats, you can't use uh, move objects, so, and you can't use uh, smooth placement like this, you're not allowed to do that, or smooth rotation, so you can't do any of that stuff, uh, and you can't, can't scale stuff, you can't move stuff up. Oh, I don't have move objects on. Uh, so yeah, you can't use move objects like this, and you can't move stuff upward. Oh, I've got to pick it up again. Like this. So you can't do that either and have stuff floating. So basically, you got to play the game without any cheats and build without any cheats. Hey, Dally, welcome back again. 87 months, very nice. And thank you so much, everyone else that is uh, subbing and, and all that. It was very appreciated. Thanks, guys. Um, yeah, and can't use any other packs, so you can only use base game and, in this case, the werewolves pack. So, I mean, you'll note, like, when you look around, if you, uh, if you look, you know, around at stuff, you'll see things that, like, I maybe wouldn't have done, uh, if I could, you know, make things a little bit more free-placed. So, like, in here, for example, so the idea of, this is actually cool, because I can give you a little bit more background on some of these builds now. The idea of this room, if you didn't watch the video that I posted on this, which I highly recommend. I think they're great videos to watch because you get to see the whole process and the thought process behind everything. Um, so with this little building, it was actually supposed to be like a little loading dock, but we kind of changed the way it looked just because it wasn't really working out too well. And personally, I think the main reason that I couldn't get it to work too well looking like a loading dock was because I didn't have any cheats and I couldn't make it look that way. But anyway, that's what this little room was supposed to be. And then in here, the, the idea is that this whole lot uh, the werewolves in the town have sort of, and the townsfolk have repurposed it into a community hub. That's why there's lots of different things like the library, the computers, a gym as well. And then also like the telescope, like the big one. Um, you know, that's why there's lots of different things here. And actually upstairs as well, there's an easel for painting just over here. So there's quite a few different activities and then the chess table, of course. So it's supposed to be like a little community hub. And it was, the idea is like the werewolves sort of just dragged these items in there and kind of left it. Um, 
But what I would have liked to do, for example, uh, if I had cheats, was, you know, move these a little bit more, just like slightly off the grid, because that makes it look way more like it's just sort of, you know, more like just dumped in there rather than being perfectly aligned with these floor tiles. Seems like a little much. Hi, Mrs. Gluon. Yeah, so that was kind of, that's kind of the things you have to work with. Um, oh, and also I just want to say the reason that this was in here is, well, number one, they suggested it. Uh, I put it in, I actually quite like the look of it. But also with, if you don't know, I think it's, I don't know if it's a base game collection update or a werewolf update, but there are new collectibles that you can gather through this larger telescope. So there are new collectibles on this one. The smaller telescope, that doesn't have the new collectible prints, but the larger one does. So I guess that's the difference between them. This one, uh, you can't get the collectibles. This one you can, uh, which is cool. So, um, yeah, that's kind of, oh, and also the toilet paper, hang on. Oh, I don't have my mods on, fair enough. Uh, the toilet paper is going the correct way, it is under rolled. As we all know, that is the way. <laughs> But yeah, so what I want to do today is uh, I saw a great comment about doing like, because it, in uh, if you haven't played The Sims 4 Werewolves, you're, if you're a werewolf, you can end up losing control and becoming, what is it, enraged? I kind of already forgot what it's called. Well, when you get too much fury and you lose control, um, and the idea was there should be like a little panic room somewhere. The, the su suggestion was actually to put a panic room over in the Volkov's house because they're about sort of more um, peace loving and they don't want to fight. So that was a great idea, but I'm actually going to do something over here because we have this sort of exposed sewer, which was so much fun to build by the way, um, but it was so hard. I, I, without any cheats, it was really hard to, to build this and make it look like not just terrible. I, I think it turned out okay. But what I would like to do is actually maybe build some more underground and you know when you travel into some of the, the underground stuff, you get all the pop-ups with some information. It's like you're in this room or that room. But there's one of them that's like called Frog City. And I feel like it'd be good to have a room just filled with collectible frogs, you know, and like like little references from the, the underground. So I thought that'd be kind of, kind of fun. Um, you know, it's a sewer, but it kind of looks like a dried out pool. Well, yeah, look, I mean, there's only so much you can do in Sims. And also like, you know, I didn't have any cheats. Also... The thing I tried to do, I don't know, did I mention this? I don't know if I mentioned this in the in the videos, but this sewer design that I put here is the same sort of uh, design I did underground on the bar. So they're supposed to feel like the same system. Um, so I, I don't know if I mentioned that, but that was the idea of it anyway. But yeah, I mean, I think it, it's, you know, kind of clear enough and it's kind of similar in idea to this one over here. Look, it would have been good if we could have put water down there, um, like just like flood it with a little bit of water, but you can't do that underground. So that would have been really nice, or even just the fountain tool, but the fountain tool also doesn't work uh, down there. But like the fountain, it can only go on ground level like that, which is not ideal. <laughs> so yeah, that's just not great. Um, yeah, it would have been nice to have like, probably a little bit of water running down there. Look, the, I guess the other thing we could have done was a pool, but then, oh man, you know Sims would have been running around in that pool um, and swimming all the time. Actually, oh, that's the other reason I couldn't do it. Yep. Yeah. So the other reason is because this is actually on a platform. The whole thing is raised up. So I'd have to make it deeper. If I go all the way down. But I thought it looked kind of... Oh, I went too far. I thought it looked kind of silly. Hang on. I'm kind of confused how far down I need to go now. I definitely went too far. <laughs> Hang on. Let me figure this out. I thought it looked kind of silly um, having it like so deep. So I'm just going to have a look and see what this looks like. We go up a little bit. So if it was there, um, and then we go up. I mean, obviously if we lowered the side, it just seems like it was too deep. Uh, and it would also then take Sims even longer to climb down into it. So, you know, it just, I, I left it a little bit shallower with the platforms, but there was no water, for example, you know. But yeah, so that's that. Um, so yeah, I want to probably build some more underground stuff, but I think we should maybe also do a little bit more. Oh, this, this, oh my gosh, this room was fun to build, but it was so hard. <laughs> the, yeah, I don't know if you guys know how hard it is to place plants and make them look, I guess, natural without using cheats in here. Uh, it was just, 
it was a nightmare to get it because I, I originally had like cracked flooring in here as well so like stuff like this but it didn't look that great because ideally you'd want to cover it up with plants but I couldn't place plants where I wanted to so it just looked bizarre <laughs> but I think it, I think it turned out okay in the end it just had to be dialed back a little bit from what I would have wanted to do also that does not light up properly yeah it looked really cool when flooded the problem with the flooding and I think I mentioned this in the video was that um, sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes when you would load the lot, so you, I don't know if you guys know this, but you can like flood rooms like that. I don't know. I don't know if that's actually a feature or not, or like a bug with the pond tool, but you can sort of flood the rooms like this, which is really cool. But sometimes when you would load in or load a new world, it just wouldn't be there. And then it would look kind of weird because it's just a room with no door. So. I decided um, that it was probably best if we just don't do that. But yeah, if you want to do it, it, it looks pretty cool. Hopefully it should stay. Where's the, um? oh yeah, the water stuff's in here. Maybe we should make it flooded again. Wait, no, where is the water? Oh, it's in here. You know, ever since they changed <laughs> the pool stuff around into this little log icon, which is really weird because there's a pool ladder here. Why can't I get the pool decorations and stuff here and, and all that? I don't know. Anyway, we're not here to complain, but <laughs> ever since I did that, I always get confused. I think either like some grimy water. Yeah, maybe like that one. That's good. Yeah, it's confusing. I think it's it, well, it's definitely part muscle memory, but then it's also if you're looking at it, it's like the pool ladder is there, so I should be able to get to it. Maybe they should just remove the pool ladder from that image or something because it is a little confusing. I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah, I don't know. We're just going to we're just going to be building today just in this lot maybe let's just add some more plants around the place I feel like this and we have all the packs now as well which of course before I only had um base game and the werewolf pack oh the other thing I want to do this you know I don't make mistakes I just make oopsie doopsies okay let's just make that real clear I am mistake free in every single way just a few little oopsies um it's not, no, it's not really a mistake, but it was actually a good suggestion in one of the comments was instead of having the broken window here to have it onto this room, because that was the, the sort of broken, like more abandoned room. Um, I was like, that's a, that's a pretty good suggestion. So maybe we should swap that around. Because I think that that does make sense. Um, and kind of, you know, kind of annoyed that I didn't do that. A little, a little, yeah, happy accident. Happy accident. Well, actually, that one's not that happy because I didn't like it, but we changed it. Um, no, I went to a window there. Let's have it like that. That's a little... I don't know what this room would be, though. Because, like... So we got the windows here. But then there's, like, no access to the room. Should should it have, like... Maybe... Wait, can you... If I... Could I have, like, a raised platform with a door on it? Is that a possible... Is that something I can do when you flood a room? Or is that not possible? If I have that and then put water in, does that work? Oh, hello. And then it, it does it. Oh, okay. You can actually. That's really interesting. What? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know what this room would be. <laughs> but you can kind of like. I do that. Wait, what? Hang on. Now there's water just on the platform, but not in the. Yeah. This is why the flooding room thing we didn't do. Because it, uh, it's a little goofy. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little weird, um, and I don't know that it's an actual thing that you really should be able to do. I mean, I love that you can do it. It's pretty cool, but it's a bit bizarre. What if I just put a door? Actually, oh, no, that's great. Now that we have other packs, I can use other doors because, like, I mean, I love the doors in this pack, but there was no good, like, single door that I could use because it just looked a bit weird. But now we might be able to use, like, one of these doors. Like, what if I use this? Oops. The picture is a foreman's office. Well, he had a tough time in his office. Actually, you know, that's not a bad idea. Can I put a desk in there? It's an abandoned old desk. And it's like just overgrown and a little bit flooded. <laughs> that's a good idea, a little office. What, what one looks the most disheveled? Maybe the red one. Yeah, I like the red one. How's that? That's pretty cool. Um... Shame there's not a doorway that's been bricked up. 
we could probably do something. Like, I mean, you could probably, if we were like breaking up a doorway, you could probably just use this and then just put, um, move, use move objects so the wall goes through it instead, maybe. But I kind of like, let's go with this. Does this have <laughs> no aliens? You know, I guess it is a, an, an occult town. There's another door. I feel like we, I'm not, I don't know if I'm convinced by that door. Also, I, I feel like we should probably have a platform here too. Oh yeah, pipes and ducting. That's a really good idea too. Yeah, it's, it's all those little things that come in all these different packs that would be really nice to add. Just to add even more detail. Oh, what about this door? Mm, that looks, that actually looks kind of too nice is the problem. It's a little bit clean. That's why this one's quite good for it. Get famous door. What was the get famous door? Let's see. You know, ever since I changed all the pack icons to the same color, I really struggle to find each pack. <laughs> but I kind of get it, because I think that we're running out of colors, so they're like, okay, let's just do one color. But it's also really annoying. <laughs> uh, oh, this door, right. Does this have like, that's a pretty good door. Ah, oh, star door. That's actually not a bad door. Because the only problem I have with this door is it's because it's white, it kind of sticks out a bit too much, and maybe this one is actually a better option. Ah, oh, Batu door! <laughs> yeah! Um, it matches a little bit better. Yeah, I think so too. I think that's good. Wait, what's this? What if you put a door and lock it for all sims, then use move objects and place some of the debug boards across it? That's a pretty cool idea. Is there... Hang on. Oh, first of all, we're definitely going to be using debug stuff, because there's a lot of great stuff in that. So let's go... Uh, testing... Sheets on... And let's get into debug. Did I type that right? I don't know if I did, but we'll see. The thing with um, debug... I don't have the tool mod and I don't use the tool mod so I don't really know what I'm doing <laughs> like if, if I were to get it anyway I don't know if they do they is there like um planks that are on the wall because I know there's a lot of planks that are just on the floor I was like wait can you lock doors on a community lot I don't even remember if you can do that I need it settled James Batu or werewolves oh you can't do me like that I can neither confirm nor deny my allegiance. Oh, I'm filtering away, get famous. That explains why there's like nothing there. Uh, yeah, I can neither confirm nor de deny my allegiance from one pack or the other. <laughs> I will say though, and of course, I mean, this is definitely going to be a bias because I built the lots in this pack. So you can believe me or not, but I, I do think Werewolves is a really good pack. At least so far what I've played and what I've done in it, I feel like it, it is really good. What is this? I don't know, but I like it. Oh, it's from Wedding Stories. Okay, we don't like it. <laughs> there are broken fence planks you can use and move objects. Oh yeah, yeah, so I, I know those ones that you're, you're talking about. I got all the wedding stuff I just have not looked at. Oh, these are so good though. Okay, no, but we can't use it because it's from Wedding Stories. I mean, I can use it, but I mean, it's just, look, that pack is not good. <laughs> that, that one's no good. All right, let me scroll down some more. What do we got? What do we got? I'm surprised you haven't removed my wedding stories. You know, I probably should. I mean, it's not as... Yeah, look, my first pet stuff is a whole other thing. Wedding stories, kind of half worked. It's still buggy and I would still not recommend it. I also don't really use it, to be fair. Like, I don't even use the world, so I guess I could just remove it. Um. All right. I guess I should probably just search debug again because I don't know where the heck I am in the menu right now. Now, also, as a heads up, it is, it's not that early. It's 8.30 in the morning for me, but normally I don't get up to like 10 or 11 in the morning. So, you know, I'm a little out of it as a heads up. <laughs> so, you know, if it takes me a little longer. So there's these ones. Oh yeah, so yeah, yeah. So I think this is what you mean. So if we use like this, uh, it's gonna be really thin though, if I need to size it down. Because, like, we could do a larger door that has a big board over it. Well, let's have a look. You know what? I'm going to... Well, we know that's there, so we can come back to it. 
Okay, you won't choose your fave, but what about worst between my first pet stuff and wedding ceremony? My first pet stuff, because I that I don't know. The idea of a DLC that requires another DLC, that's just not a good idea. And I'm glad they've not done that again since that. So, you know. <laughs> that will always be my least favorite, for sure. Uh let's see. I don't want this stream to just be me scrolling through the menu, so I might just come back and do stuff. So it's like these ones, but yeah, these ones are flat on the ground. All right, let's just build stuff because the those sort of more nitpicky details I can always just come back and do. So I think I need a platform on this side, otherwise the door looked kind of a little bit strange. So let's just do that. Um, yeah, see, look, the pond's already gone again. So that's, that's the thing with the water. It kind of just disappears. It, like it comes and goes. Um, caution signs and Strangerville debug. Yeah, if you know any good items for, and what specific package is in, we'll be able to find it a little bit quicker. I guess I probably should also, you know, there, there's a lot of good mods out there that I just don't have. Like the better, what is it, the better build by? Oh no, is that separate? The one that has like the better debug menu. I should probably use that because that would be great. <laughs> be a lot better to use. All right, this, this looks kind of weird because we got the stairs that come straight down and then there's like another step. Maybe, should we raise up this whole section so then the stairs come onto that? But then it kind of, mm. now we're getting into a weird territory. Maybe the whole room should be raised. Maybe that's an easier option like that because then it doesn't look weird. And then we could do a step out the front. Yeah, maybe that works. Now this room is also... This is the only problem with doing this stuff, is that you end up with a weird section. See, that would be fine if it just had the floor tile color. Like, I don't mind there being a step here. But the fact that it has, like, light gray going through it, kind of annoying. Better build buyers the bomb. Yeah. I, I used it once, and then I just never use it again. I don't, I don't know why. There's not really any reason. I guess I just never updated it. <laughs> like, I, I'm really bad when it comes to updating mods. So I just kind of, I guess I just don't have it. The white bugs me too, yeah. Well then, do we just raise up this whole room? Are we just putting the whole thing on a platform? Oh no, now we have it here. Let's raise up the outside! <laughs> hmm. See, I don't, again, I don't mind that, where the door is over it and you can't see it and there's like a step, that's okay. I mean, definitely a tripping hazard, but I don't mind that. Maybe we just change that to a door, or is that... Is that ruining the, the original? Yeah, it looks kind of weird though, doesn't it? Hmm. Maybe, okay. Maybe I go back. I think I'm, I think I'm getting a little carried away here. Maybe we just ignore that and pretend it's fine. <laughs> let's just pretend. Okay, let's go back to this room. Because this room is looking cool. I feel like this is looking good. Um, you can't really cover it with terrain. Uh, because... Because this is a platform, so like I'll show you at the front. Because this is a platform, I can't actually move terrain above the wall height. If if it was a foundation, I could, uh, but platforms you can't. So it just it can't go any higher than that, unfortunately. All right, I mean that's fine to me. All right, so then there's this little room that's a little flooded. It's beautiful. I might actually remove. Can I put? Can I keep the door there with this being down? Oh 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 dear. I can keep the door there, which is good, because what I want to do... Let's put that back. <laughs> Why is this two separate sections? Yeah, this water thing is so weird. Let's get rid of that. Okay, there we go. Uh, oh. Oh, it's like a... Okay, it's like a separate room. Okay. <laughs> okay, hang on. There we go. Now it should be... Oh, wait. No, it's not the same room. Okay. All right. Okay, now it's the same. Ah, oh, now I can't do it. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, let's go back to the weird glitchy version. Okay, that's fine. Let's just go with that. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, this 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 is this is why this is why we didn't do this in the official uh, lot. Okay, I like that. We got a little abandoned office. Old site manager. Maybe we should get some signs and stuff up. Oh, we should get the ducting too. Is it cold ducting or is it going to be hard to? Uh, Find it. Oh, good it is. Okay, let's get some of these. 
So I think maybe if we go, let's just have one. I might actually swap this light to go this way. Mm, or is that going to be, maybe we should do a different light in this room because it's kind of blocking this. I want to be able to see that. All right, well, oh, we should just do the little, my favorite light. Oh, Batu. No, not Batu. Though they are, those are good lights. Uh, where is my little light bulb on a string? That's what I want to use. Hmm. Why am I not seeing it? Oh, it's because it, I mean, to this day, I still don't know why this light is so expensive, 150. Yeah, the door is still raised because if we lower it, I can't place it because it can't be placed in the water. So I'm just leaving this room raised up so that from this side, it looks normal. And this side, I think it still looks fine from this side because the, the water sort of covers up a bit of it. There you go, single light bulb, beautiful. And then we're going to go definitely want to like a more roughed up looking one. Yeah, that's good. That's good stuff. Hmm, it doesn't quite line up with the wall. So do it there. Now, do we put like a vent over here? I guess we probably should. For where that goes to the wall. Or we could just have it... Or we have it turn. Go this way. Yeah, let's do that, because then we get more ducting. Beautiful. I should probably change the color first. There we go. Oh. Oh wait, no, that, I was going to say that doesn't line up, but it does. Cool. And then we could have a duct come along here too. I think because that's still underneath this section. Yeah, so we can do that. More ducklings. Oh, can I actually put ducklings in here? That'd be pretty old. Wait, where are they? Oh, here we go. <laughs> Mr. Ducksworth. <laughs> yeah, let's totally do that. That's awesome. Oh, actually, that's above. It needs to be below. Like, it needs to be in the water. I don't know. Does this Is this going to work? What is this? I put it there. It's like in the water. Is that the right spot? Wait. Hang on. I actually don't know. How do these... I want to place it correctly. So I'm just checking. So if I had water here, and then I placed it... Where is it? Where are they placed? Oh, oh, wait. So they placed on the surface, not underneath. Okay. That's fine. So it does actually need to be up, to up top. Yeah, it's supposed to go above. Thanks, guys. All right, so we'll have some duck, duckling in there. Mr. Ducksworth. And should we have mallard ducks? Or just Mr. Duck Ducksworth? Maybe Mr. Ducksworth, because that's his office. Is there a duck picture? Duck. No, but let's get a, let's get a rubber ducky in here. Just, we'll have it float on the water over here. See, you know, it's these kind of things that you can't do when you're building official lots. Mm, I guess yellow is the best. There you go. So I'll swim through the desk. Yeah, that's fine. I think I think it'll be fine. It'll just it'll just look kind of cool. <laughs> All right, what was I doing? I was getting. I want to get. The, oh, actually, this is other stuff I really wanted to do. Yes, cobwebs. I mean, this is like, this is def. Okay, well, I'm trying to place it in the right spot. This is definitely something that's like perfect for this build from uh, the Vampires pack. Do I not have move objects on? I thought I did. No, I do. I guess you just can't even place it in water with move objects. Which, I mean, look, it's a cobweb, so I guess that makes sense, but still. <laughs> uh, no, what would you have? So on a brick wall, just like, I guess, cracks and stuff for sure. See, that, that was the thing. So um, the Werewolves pack did add like cracks and stuff, which is great. And I, I think I mentioned this about in every single video. When I was building them, I didn't have them yet. So I didn't really get around to adding many of them, unfortunately. So let's get a few more of those in. You don't own vampires, but you really want to just for the cobwebs. Oh, the cobwebs are great. I mean, I wouldn't recommend buying any pack just for cobwebs. But if you wanted to buy it just for cobwebs. I wouldn't stop you either. I'm gonna have that in front of it. Is that the wrong color, this one? I feel like that looks different. No, no, it's the same. It just, for some reason, the color doesn't quite match. Also, this doesn't quite line up with the wall, uh, but I'm just gonna go through the wall. We'll just do that, and then we'll continue it in this room. I'll do that in a second. All right, what else we got? Hmm. All right, we need like 
some signs and stuff maybe. Oh, I know. Yeah, some of does this have like the whoops, whoa. That is not what I meant to do. <laughs> yeah, some of these are sort of a bit more faded. Do we want to do no, no, no. I want to do like is it city living that has the old like I guess uh what what do you call it? Billboards that are kind of torn down a bit. And where is that? Did I go past it? No, it's cats and dogs, wasn't it? I think they had some. Oh, graffiti. Definitely gonna have graffiti. You know, I wish you could change the opacity on this because this looks way too clean. <laughs> mm. I guess there's some in debug as well, isn't there? Like that kind of stuff. Hang on, this wouldn't make sense in here. Let's do it outside. Like having a big billboard thing. You definitely, I could definitely imagine a big billboard being on the outside of a building that's just like sort of worn down. What would this be? So shrimp. I mean, look, it was a it's supposed to be like a, a a mill, like a lumber mill, but I don't think we have any lumber mill signs. So I'm just going to use something else. Look, it could have been an advertisement. So I'm going to put that there. No, I'm going to put. It looks so bright though. No, I need something more faded than that. Industrial kit has a bunch. You know what, let me, let me see, what do we got? Oh, yeah, so I hate how you can't, yeah, here we go. I hate how you can't, um, filter by specific kit. Yeah, this is better, yeah, okay, let's do, oh, that looks good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I don't, I'm not a huge fan of kits, and that's why I usually don't do videos specifically on them. Some of them I do, and you would have seen some of them, obviously. But, um, the industrial kit has some good stuff. I made a video at the time being like how, you know, you could build similar stuff in the existing game. But I think I even said in that video, these items are obviously better, but like you don't need the kit. So they're kind of, I think if I recall, the point I was trying to make in that specific video about the industrial kit was that, you know, kits are kind of just like, you don't really need them. A lot of the stuff you could probably just kind of do already, but they add nice variety to certain aspects. I don't know if this is going to make sense anywhere around here. So I don't generally do videos on them because I don't, there's not really any point. I don't think I'm going to do that there. Just so it's kind of a bit faded. Most kids feel like there should be free updates. I mean, yeah, I mean, some of them do, but then like, I don't know. It's all personal preference. I mean, look, I, I don't reckon you should get them because you don't need them. But I mean, if you want to go for it, have fun. I do, I do think they should be cheaper though. I feel like the, the them at full price isn't a great deal. They And I, I think I said this when Kids First came out. I feel like they should be about half the price of what they actually are. And then that would probably be a better deal. But I don't think they ever put them on sale, which is a shame. Because I feel like they probably should. Do I think high school is the next pack? I don't know, because that, that was, well, that was leaked, right? Or like a supposed leak. From the, um, was that, was that like an origin survey or something? It was like some survey, wasn't it? I kind of like just loosely follow these things. I never really look too closely at leaks because I don't, well, number one, because I make videos obviously on the game and I usually want my first reaction to a pack that's coming up to be like the trailer or the announcement. So I generally don't like read into um, any leaks too closely, but I, I mean, that was all over Twitter. Cause that was, wasn't that the same day? Was it the same day that werewolves had a trailer? Or it was like the same day as some werewolves news. And then there was like a high school leak at the same time, right? A survey that got the pack name wrong. Oh, that's right. Yeah, so it was like an official survey, but then they called, then they called city living something else. It was like city, or was it one of the other packs that they like used all the wrong names and stuff. It was really bizarre. So I don't know. I mean, I guess it could be. I think uh, eco living. <laughs> oh, yeah, they, they called it eco living instead of eco lifestyles. Like, I mean, yeah, so I don't know. But if it was an official email, I don't know. That's weird. OK, so we got some more ducting there. I don't really know where this ducting is going. It's just kind of hanging out. We need pipes. Oh, I need signs. I never got around to that bit. <laughs> Yeah, this is fun. This is fun, guys. Just adding little details together. You guys have some good ideas. So I kind of... Oh, you know what we should add? Where's those get to work exit signs? Is that in wall decorations? Because those are good. There's also, yeah, there's a lot of good get to work um, signage. 
I'm trying to remember where that is. Uh, so there's no special guest today because the official, um, so this was originally a sponsored stream. It's not sponsored today at all by anyone, but it, it was originally scheduled to be a sponsored stream with EA and would have a special guest on. That will be rescheduled, so stay tuned. I'll, I'll post about it the same way I posted about this one when it's rescheduled. But yeah, no no uh, no guest today, just just me. Oh, and Deli, and she'll be back, I'm sure, so. Deli was our extra special guest. Not just a special guest, extra special. Uh, oh, Batu. Actually, yeah, Batu has some good stuff. And look, I know I kind of meme about Batu and how much I love it. Um... But it does. Oh, you know what? This is actually a great iron. Oh, this is what I need for down here for the sewer because I had to use those stupid little vents. Actually, I can probably use the debug vent, um, sewer thing. But yeah, no, this is actually good. I actually want to use this. Yeah, no, I, yeah, what I was saying is I meme about how much I love Batu, but the build bar in Batu is actually really good. So if you can get it on sale, I would actually recommend it. Um, like a good, like if you don't want the gameplay, uh, if you get it on sale, you'll probably be quite happy with it, to be honest. And because Batu is one of the packs where it, if you don't go to the Batu world, it doesn't change anything, which is either a good thing or a bad thing, depending on how you look at it. But so if you don't want people with lightsabers walking around, they won't be, which is nice. That's a bit random there, isn't it? Why would it be there? Let's put it over this side. I don't know what this is for either, but it's going to go over here. There's a sale right now. Oh yeah, isn't there like a Steam sale? Is it only on Steam or is there an Origin sale as well? There's some sale. They always have sales, so there's always a chance to get this stuff. Yeah, I want to do some graffiti outside. Oh yes, the um, fire extinguisher. That's a great item to put in here too. Let's go red. Ah, here we go. These sun. This is kind of what I want. I need some more of these things around the place. One in here. Yeah, I'll, I'll do graffiti and stuff around as well. Origin 2. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah. So, so yeah, there's some good sales at the moment. Yeah, if you can get a good sale, that too is a great pack for build buy. <laughs> what kind of pack do you think is missing in The Sims? Hmm. I don't know. You know, I actually don't know. So chat, what do you reckon is missing in The Sims 4 right now? Like, well, I guess cars, but like, <laughs> besides cars. As, a, as like a, as like an overall pack idea. Oh, hotels, yeah, yeah, true. That that would actually be good. I That was one of my favorite series in The Sims 3 was uh, Island uh, Paradise. Oh, that has no colors. Island Paradise, running hotels and, and buying all the real estate. That was great. Like if we had something like that again in hotels, that'd be amazing. Generations. Now, Look, I don't want to get cancelled, and like I said, I don't make mistakes. I just make oopsie doopsies, but I never really played Generations, and I don't really know what's in Generations, so can can you guys enlighten me? <laughs> like, what is that? I feel like, you know the meme where someone's like, everyone's talking about blank, and now I'm too afraid to ask what it is? That's how I am with Generations. Like, I know obviously it's like, to do with more family kind of stuff, but like, what's in it? I never played that back. <laughs> And I never really looked into it. Uh-oh. Plumbell is going to come for me. Uh-oh. Sims beef. You know, back then in Sims 3, I didn't... I did do Let's Plays from time to time, but not nearly as many Let's... Like, I do a Let's Play on, like, every single major pack in The Sims 4. So I have a really good understanding of, you know, all the packs that are in this game. But in Sims 3, I didn't do that. I kind of mostly built... And then I did some Let's Plays near the end of the lifespan of Sims 3. So there's a lot of packs I actually missed. Like, I never really played Supernatural in Sims 3 either. Um, so I don't really know specifically what's going on in that pack. Uh, there's bachelor parties, kids sleepovers, teen house parties. You know, something we don't need in Sims 4 is more party types. I said it. I mean, what's the difference? All the parties are the same. People come around, eat food, and then leave. <laughs> No, but like having, doing like a slumber party, that would be kind of fun. If they, if they had like um, actual items that make sense with it, if you could like do pillow fights and stuff and that, that kind of stuff, you know, that'd be kind of cool. But the 50,000 different party types we have in Sims 4, they're all kind of the same. <laughs> also, I'm just adding pipes around the place. 
they don't really do anything or go anywhere, but they look industrial. Oh, yeah. Now, again, I don't make mistakes. Just little oopsie doopsies. Someone did point out that... Now, there's no mirrors here. And you know what? When I was building in this room, I actually, at the end, decided not to put mirrors there. Like, I, I looked at this. I was like, you know what? No, I don't want to put mirrors there because this is supposed to be like an abandoned uh, factory that, you know, stuff would have been ripped out, stuff's gone, all that kind of stuff. Maybe the mirrors are stolen. But in the initial build when I was building it, I mentioned putting mirrors there later. Uh, but I don't think I ever mentioned my decision not to put them there. Um, and I actually think it's it's fine. I guess it's just a little unintuitive because normally, you know, you'd find the mirror above the sink. But we do have mirrors. They're just over here in the gym. Well, mirror. It's over in the gym rather than uh, in the bathroom. So I guess that's my bad. That's maybe a little unintuitive for people playing this a lot. Uh, so sorry about that. <laughs> Uh, I will put some mirrors in here though. Maybe we should, should we do the werewolf ones? Those are pretty cool. Where are they? Uh, ah, oh, the lockers. Yeah, we should add the lockers too. That'd be cool. Is there like some lockers that kind of look like they're, uh, like beaten up and run down? Oh, maybe these. Oh, they'll get to work. The little dinky ones. You know, I actually kind of like that. Oh, actually, isn't there, where's all the, um, yeah, let's filter by get to work. Cause get to, get to work, you know, is a great pack for industrial stuff too, actually. Because that's got a lot of little thing, like the little hand um, sanitizer or hand soap thing. This is great. What colors does it come in? Oh, okay, that's it. <laughs> but yeah, this is a great little item. I'm going to put it there. Does that look weird next to the mirror like that, though? Should it be the same height as a mirror? But then that would be really high up. Or is that okay? Is that too high? No, I guess it'd be okay. Because if you're washing your hands there, you could just be like soap there. I don't know. Lower looks good. Just right. Okay, I don't know. It's split. You know, I'll put it there. Whatever. It's fine. Um, what do you say, Deli? Deli said, I love the pipes. Nice. Yeah, there's just kind of pipes everywhere now. <laughs> this is my remastered edition. <laughs> Size it down? Nah, I think it's okay. I think it's just because the mirror looks really small. Maybe I should just get a bigger mirror. Let's have a look. I do want to get... Oh, the paper towel. Yes some paper towel maybe over here. Actually, you know what? Let's put it on this side. It's a long way to walk. <laughs> um, and then I guess I should have a bin. Ooh, vent thing. Miscellaneous vent thing. Let's put that on the wall. <laughs> Sweet. I'd also like you to know Bowser has done a healthy poo-poo. Well, that's great. Thanks, Deli. It is actually good. I mean, because the last couple of days he was a little off. So Bowser is nice and healthy again. That's good to know. Um, we need... Oh, security cameras. We don't need that. No, I need a bin is actually what I need. Mm, I guess I don't even get to work bin. I don't know why I'm filtering by that. Let's get a regular bin. Let's get... I mean, just that like a little tiny waste. Actually, is that one that kind of looks gross? We need like a bin that's nasty, you know, like an all grimy. I guess this one does suit well. I just want more grime in the game. Can we, oh, that's, you know, that's the pack we're missing in The Sims 4, grime stuff. And you should buy grime stuff. And you know how you have to clean counters? They should just add that filter to every single item in the game. <laughs> Imagine how annoying that would be. So you just, eventually you like everything gets a layer of grime on it and you have to clean it. But then if you don't clean it, it'd be awesome. Surely someone could make a mod for that. I mean, I say surely like I have any idea if that's possible, but now that would be good stuff. Um, okay, this bathroom's looking a little bit better. You know, a few more little knickknacks in here. A uh, little office. Oh yeah, I want to do some more stuff in this office. If, oh, you know, Strangerville stuff would be great in here. Like the thrown away, like the boxes that are kind of on the ground and stuff. Uh, Strangerville. Wait, there's no items for Strangerville? Oh, hello? Show, show all? Oh, okay, there we go. I was like, um... Pretty much bust the dust on everything. Oh, that'd be amazing. As long... You know what I would like? If, if they ever did something like that, or like a pack kind of like bust the dust again, 
Yes, the option to turn those systems on and off is good, but I would like an option to have the system on so stuff gets dusty, but also an option that my sims don't get annoyed by it. So that it could just be dusty and they just like leave it. I know I was I mean, I sure one of the traits does that, right? Like the um is it slob or something? I think the traits help with that. But also just like an option and get that's you know, that's what we're missing in Sims 4. More options for customization in the like menus to like more fine-tune how you want the game to work. That'd be good. Ooh, sign. Does this make sense here? It kind of looks more like a diner sign. Maybe not that. All right. Um, oh, cars. Oh, actually, yeah. The, oh, there's so many good debug stuff that came with this pack. We'll have to look at that in a minute. Use some of those. They're getting better, including customization options. Yeah, they are. I mean, the, the customization with the neighborhood stories is really cool. And then the lunar phase customization in werewolves is really good. I love that. It's really good that you can do that. Oh, I, lo I love the flood in this room. It's so cool. The darker colored barrel there. Um, I would put these in the water, but it kind of looks a bit weird because they're not wet. <laughs> what if I do like a puddle under the water? Because then it kind of adds like a little bit more detail. Yeah, which way is it facing? Oh, it oh wait, no, that was right. I'm going to put that way and put it like against the wall. Yeah, it's really hard to see, but it adds like a subtle color shift there, which is kind of nice. Well, it's gross, but <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh, what else we got? Strangerville. Anything good in here? Maybe this chair. I kind of, oh, you know what? We need a chair like on its side. Maybe we need to get a debug. I think there's some good stuff in there. We need some junk. All right, let's have a look. Let's go to, I think, I mean, Werewolves itself had some really good debug stuff, so. Oh, factory rubble. Oh yeah, I used to have some factory rubble in this room. Um, but because I didn't have move objects, it was like impossible to like place it in a way that looked good. So now we can do it. Yes, that is great. Look at that. Just sticking out of the water. Oh, oh fan. Now uh, what else we got? Oh. These logs. I wish, you know, I wish they would have let me use the debug stuff. I get why you can't because I guess players would then load the lot. And so one of the reasons is players would load the lot and then they can't eye drop it. So then, I mean, that would just confuse a lot of people because if you deleted it, they wouldn't be able to get it back. And then the other reason is some of these items Sims can just like walk through. Um, some of them you can't and it's fine, but yeah, I get it. But it would have been nice to have like this. Some of these are like really cool. Oh, this has got a top over some planks. Oh my gosh. Put these here. Oh wait, it's kind of floating a little bit. Oh, there we go. No colors, that's fine. Yeah, debug is so cool. Oh, the portal potties. I reckon they should have done a version of this that was actually porta potties. Like maybe even had these two function as a toilet and then just that as the one you go down. That would have been cool. Because these look so cool. And wouldn't it actually be nice to have an outhouse? Because I mean, like, I had to build my own outhouse on this lot. So it would have been nice to have like an actual object to do that. Oh yeah, so this, so this is actually the uh, underground entrance over here. I am a little curious how this works. Because <laughs> if I have two of these in the world, will my, how does that work? Will my sim pop out of this one? <laughs> ah, bunker entrance, that's cool. The other thing we could do instead of using that because I'm not I'm not sure about that one. We could use they actually have um, oh bridge, Oh, junk yes, junkin. Hang on, let's get some junk in here. They've got some of the similar stuff to Stranger Villa too, which is actually kind of nice. How big is this? Yeah, that fits. There we go. Yes, junkin. Ah, oh, tire. Put it down here. <laughs> it's a bit random. Let's put it over here. <laughs> I'm just gonna shove it in here. It's got some grass growing out of it. Um, what was I looking for? Oh yeah, it's like falling over stuff. Uh, actually, could, this could work in here. An old like dresser that's kind of fallen over. That's cool. Ah, oh, the I love these too. So ah, oh, pallets. Ah, oh, this would have been great. 
so many great items in, in Tupac that I wish I could have used. Uh, what was I looking for? I keep getting distracted. Oh, this, the um, sewer grate. Because uh, there is... Oh, chimney. This would have been great too. Did I put it on... Hang on. Oh, but I don't have that. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would be a bit weird. Oh, that's so cool. The pro I, I didn't really design this building for a chimney. So I definitely would have put one if I could. Let me get rid of the HVAC and then put this in. Put it like there. Does that look weird? That looks kind of weird because the bricks are like the wrong color. Yeah, that doesn't really work. Let's not do that. It's cool though. <laughs> we can use a different one. Okay, this, this one here. So this is just a decorative one which is used uh, over here, like down the, the sewer area. So I could probably just put this underneath and this would work for well, visuals anyway. And I could probably, how far back can it go before it sort of doesn't work? Oh, that works. Sweet. Yeah, that's so much, that, that's much more like what I wanted it to be, but obviously that didn't really exist as an item. Sweet. And then I guess that's still just, I don't know. I guess the idea with this is it would probably run through here and then just come out into the into this area, into the river. Oh my gosh, these lights as well. I wish these were like actual lights that we could use in, in um, regular game. The perfect. Do these emit any light or are they just, oh, they actually do, that's so cool. I mean, like they illuminate, but I don't think they actually produce light, right? Let's see. Sometimes it takes a minute when you place a light. No. So what we could do, because like they sort of turn on, we could maybe put a light inside of it. So it still like has light coming from it, but it doesn't really. Build the rage room. Yeah, I kind of got distracted by just junking up this area. I mean, I think this looks so much better, like already, just having all this stuff in here. Um, yeah, so I do want to go down. I want to build some sewer stuff. Right? That's what I mentioned earlier. Uh, where should we go down? Like, how do, how do we get down there? Where's a good place for that? You know what I wish we, we had is like, um, sort of, uh, how do you describe it? Like basement, a basement stair sort of setup where you have the doors on top. So it's just like a small entrance and like a steep descent. That'd be nice. Down through the sewer. Oh, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Where should, how should we get down there? Uh, cellar door. Yeah, cellar door. That'd be cool if we had. Maybe I should get rid of this. Not that way. Um, hmm, I'm just, might actually be a bit difficult to go that way. What if we go? Yeah, a trap door would be good if we had that. Storm shelter, yeah. So I'm thinking we could do like, what if we, we could turn one of the bathrooms into like a way to get down, kind of like the portal potties. Or we just have like a more obvious way to get down somewhere. I'm not really sure where we should put it. Underneath a gym. Yeah, that could work. Maybe we could do, uh, you know what? Maybe we can turn this back into like a loading dock area too. But maybe later. Let's do, I'm gonna have this little section at the back here. Did they fix the bug where, let me, oh, whoops. No, no. Did they fix, okay, let me click on that, thank you. Did they fix the bug where I can open it to a basement? Yeah, because there was like a bug where you couldn't see through the floor. Okay, well, kind of. I think it may be fixed. <laughs> it kind of comes and goes. So what I was thinking is that what if we do this, get rid of that. And I feel like that fence is not secure enough. <laughs> I feel like that's a little rough. I'm gonna do this. I don't think I want it this big. I might make it smaller, but I was just getting started. Do it more like that. That kind of seems like a very dangerous thing to have in this room. <laughs> what about if, oh, you know what we could do actually? 
It, I think it actually looked kind of cool. Uh, let me go. No, no. Yeah. Okay. And this is gonna go to there. I don't know why I got rid of my punching bag. So I want to change this to use the like one of these sensors maybe. So it's almost like caged off. Needs to be more brown though. Not that brown, maybe less brown than that. Also, it's a little strange how it's doing the fence post at the moment. <laughs> I don't know if I'm liking that. Hang on. Oh, that's better. So it's like sort of, yeah, caged off like that. And then you could have like, no, not a door. Actually a door could work there. But like, uh, not that, because I guess, I guess we could do barbed wire, but it's a bit weird. But just like this. Yeah, let's put it there. Like so. Um, and then we can do like some... Oh, is that supposed to be... Wait, what? Why is there a con here now? Oh, is... oh no. Don't tell me that doesn't work. Okay, <laughs> so you can see, I don't know if you can see what's happening, so heart, this column appears on the outside and, and only on the outside, not on the inside, but here where we have the floor open, the column appears on both sides for some reason. <laughs> so it just creates inconsistency. <laughs> uh, okay, well let's just do columns here too then, because otherwise it looks kind of weird. Sure. Cool, whatever. All right, so that's gonna go there. Let's get some stairs. I like that. I like that as like a little thing. I don't know what this would have been used for in the actual place, maybe like storage, have like a storage section down here. And then behind the storage, it goes into the sewers. Oh yeah, maybe that will work. Yeah, let's do it like that. And then, okay, let's get some lights. So I can see what I'm doing and then we'll make it more moody. I always like some lights just to get an idea of what's going on. Now, I, I didn't want to do a ladder because I feel like this could actually be a cool space down here. Oh, actually, let's get... So what I want to do... So this is going to be... No, this is not a jail. <laughs> no, no. It's just like... It'll be like... It'll be like a... Because, okay, so this was... Originally in my head, like a loading dock, right? So deliveries would come in here. And then, not that it makes sense to be downstairs, but maybe they would have had like a, an elevator or something for goods. And then they had like storage down here for whatever reason. That's just the way they did it, okay? Don't, don't ask me. That's just, they did it this way, not me. Whoever built this factory in law, obviously I built it, but you know, <laughs> in, within the game law. Let's make that a bit smaller like that. Imagine, oh, uh, yeah, okay, I gotta, I gotta make this a separate room so I can put a roof on it. Otherwise we'll have a big hole, there we go, and then I can remove this, I think. Yeah, cool, that's fine. Alright, so that's there. Then, I actually kind of think it would look cool if we do it like this, so we're gonna have hallway there. It'll make more sense in a second, hallway here. Del oops, delete this section. Where's that little light? There it is. I'll make sure I can light it up for now. And then, brick, brick, brick. Although, would it be brick in the basement? Yeah, let's do brick, because otherwise it, it kind of, it probably wouldn't match if I changed it. You know, there's no mistakes here on the channel. All just happy accidents. Then I'm gonna have these puppies. Like that. Actually, I wonder, can I flip these just so it's not like so copy? Yeah, there we go. So they don't look identical next to each other. Oh yeah, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Now flooring wise. Um hmm.
Yeah, I kind of... Does this one come in a color that matches? Uh, see, we I need like the darker mortar in between, like the bricks, it's a little bit dirtier, and this one has that. But I don't really like that it's in the sort of um, herringbone pattern. But I guess that'll work. So anyway, the idea with this is we have this room, and then we have... Uh, no, not storage. What am I doing? Oh, actually, maybe storage. Oh, actually, we wanted to do lockers up here. It's a good thing I clicked on storage. I'm gonna have some old lockers here. Can I make these look more scuffed up? Not really, but we'll just do it that color. There you go. Um, all right, so down here, I want to go to surfaces. Batu stones. Uh, they'll be like more grayish though in color, which I don't really want. Oh, why didn't. Look, it's early in the morning. I didn't mean to click on storage again. I want... Ah, oh, Batu. <laughs> yeah! Nah, some of this kind of stuff, maybe not like that exactly, but you know, some storage shelves and stuff. Maybe not that. Probably, to be honest, we do empty shelves. And the ones I'm thinking of are the ones that look like they aren't in this category. For some reason. <laughs> Wait, are they actually not? Hang on. Wait, where is... Let's get to work. Oh, they're actually not in this category. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense, right? The huge shelving unit isn't in the shelving category. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna use these. And then... We do a little bit... You know, a little bit like this. Maybe we have a gap, we'll have some boxes or something. You know, some old storage that was left down here. I have no idea what this would have been used for, but I think it would look cool. <laughs> because I, I actually think I might make it thinner. Because I kind of want it so when you're here, oh, you can kind of see it. Yeah, I wanted it when you're here, you can kind of like see the, the stuff in the sides. I don't want to. I don't want to do too much because I don't want to have to spend a million years trying to decorate all this. But something like that. I might move this one down a bit more. Okay. So let's have a look at some debug stuff because I'm sure there's some good stuff we can get in there. Ah, oh, wood pile. Some good stuff we can get in here. Oh, I'm filtered by something, right? What's happening? I'm just turn it off and on again. Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> I think I just, I think I, yeah, I need to do this. That's a surface, not a shelf. Oh, silly me. <laughs> Sorry, Deli. Deli knows the Sims better than me. What's the purpose of this basement? Well, at the moment, yeah, so this would have, uh, originally the idea is this would have been storage uh, for the, the mill, but it's obviously since abandoned, uh, let's see, what else can we get in here? I just want some some junk. We need some junk stuff. I guess Strangerville and uh, Werewolves would be good. Mmm, plants. Frog City, yeah, we gotta do Frog City. That won't be here though. So, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm getting distracted by the bug stuff. This, I really wanted some sort of sign for this factory. But it just, oh, actually, that's not a sign. That's a door. <laughs> I, I remember because I used this once before. But yeah, I want like a big sign for this factory, but it didn't exist in base game or um, werewolves. So if we see a big sign, ooh, fire escape. I will want to put that up there. I'm just going to sort of scroll through. Oh, graffiti. Well, that's so clean, though. See, that? <laughs> that's the problem. That looks like way too clean. Uh, nope. Yeah, and then at the back I'm gonna do a, like, a, maybe a door, or like we'll try to do like a sewer entrance kind of thing. And that will go into where all that stuff is. Oh yeah, here we go. Mold, like weeds. Ah, oh, boat! <laughs> mm, let's see, what else we got? Am I going to move Nina and Angus to this redone world? I mean, 
it's not a bad idea. I, I won't move them to this world, but we could definitely use this lot in the existing world. Okay, we definitely need some... How would that even get in there? Hang on, I gotta think about this. <laughs> okay, this could be this could be put in here. Let's put this over here. Oh, this is a debug one. I, I guess I could use the actual ones that I could change the color on. That might be a better idea, but I'm not going to. Uh, let's see, let's go... Let me scroll down a bit. <gasps> Batu. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, that's sick. Uh, okay, here we go. Eco lifestyle. This is this is what we need. Some papers. Ah, oh, barrel. Barrels are always good. They're a good time. Ah, oh, bags of trash. Maybe I'll just layer that in the back as well there. This is definitely what we need. Yeah, this is good. Ooh, and like an electric panel thing. I don't know where this would go. Nowhere down, nowhere down here. Maybe this one. This is better, yeah. I'll put this down here. We'll set a breaker. Oh no, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> now I've left the area. I guess I should I should just filter. I don't know why I'm scrolling through everything. All right, eco lifestyle. What else you got for me? Oh, this stuff is so good too. You don't have enough barrels in your life? Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, pipes. Sweet. Uh, I don't know why there'd be an oven down here. So I'm not gonna put it down here because yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Why, why would there have ever been an oven? Okay, I think that's a good starting point. Let's get some more, I want some more junk in the middle of the room. It's like, oh, splayed out. Just like that, and maybe... Uh, where's the... Oh, there. Now, these trash bags, do these make Sims unhappy or will I try to move them? I just don't want them moving stuff. That's pretty good. All right, so then this section, okay, so now what's gonna happen because I want to go in, in to the sewer. And this is where we'll have some stuff down here. Now, let's build it like... Uh, well, it's only four wide, but I've made this three wide, so that's kind of a little awkward. <laughs> cool. I'm going to do it like this. Actually, what we could do, why don't we just do it like this? You go in and then it goes sideways. Now I've got to figure out the best way to build this sewer because obviously this one's up higher. Um, hello? Hello. Oh, you're coming in to spend the day here. You've come with food, you're getting ready to settle in. Oh yeah, I'm here for the oh, whole I should... day. <laughs> should probably change the lighting in here, actually. I just thought Did I... you want the chair? We can pull it forward. Um, is that okay? Yeah, hang on. Wait. Sorry, I don't mean to interrupt. No, 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 no. It's fine, hang on. No, wrong one. Hang on, I'm gonna find it. There we go. Just go. Oh. I thought you were gonna go to be right back, not no. like show the whole... No, I show the whole thing. Well, that's a bit of a flex. My Lego pile. My Lego gets its own chair. No, no, no! <laughs> <laughs> Can I show them this? Because it's really cool. Oh, yeah. That, this one was out of stock, and I got it as soon as I came back, because I was like, that's sick. How cool is this? Very cool. We actually saw one of these on our road trip, like, in real life. Oh, yeah, we saw an actual DeLorean, I, um, I which really was sick. <laughs> I've never... Oh, no, I have seen one in person, but I've never seen one just on the road. Like, that was kind of weird. <laughs> Yeah, that was very Especially cool. in Australia. Like, I didn't even know and it, people would have had it here. It was um, right-wheel drive, too. Yeah, because I don't think they would have made any left-hand drive versions. Oh, but was it American? Oh, I mean left... Wait, now I'm getting confused. Well, we're left-hand drive. Like, oh, no, right-hand drive on the left-hand side of the road. That, uh, yeah, now I'm... I'm yeah, you know it. That, I was yeah, right. no, I know what you mean. I Yeah, <laughs> I said it wrong as well. <laughs> Do you want me to put this yeah. down? Pulling. <laughs> All right, so let's get back to. Oh, it's 
such a big comfort chair. I hope you don't mind me interrupting <laughs> everyone. I can show you what I've your ti- your done special so far. time with James. Yeah, this is a rat wall. You're so small. Yeah. I can join you. Oh. Only fair. <laughs> now we're really little. And then I can bring it up a bit. If I move back. Hang on. Oh, Matthew Riley owns a DeLorean. That is so cool. That's sick. All right, so. All right, let me just get some lights in here, because I feel like, oh, I need, so I'm just building, so I want to build some underground tunnels in this library. That's so, the plan. Tunneling. Tunneling. Yeah, that's the plan. I want a nice, what's a good wall? Oh, actually, where's that one from? Ah, oh, this one. This is sick. I love that light. I know. This looks really cool. Thank you. Chat built it. It wasn't me. Aww. Chat's the real talent here. Aww. Uh, let's get... Yeah, let's get some of these in here, maybe. Although, no, it should be, like... I wish it was horizontal, not vertical. Tool mod. I don't have that installed <laughs> right now. Oh, actually, this one. Yeah, here we go. Let's do this. It's gonna have really dingy lighting. Ew. I'll steal all the credit. Yeah, thanks, chat. You guys really, you guys really pull through on this one. That is the worst, um, like most unflattering lighting with fluorescent. <laughs> like you always look so bad on. Oh, why did I make this side longer? I don't know. I might change that. And the weird thing is, they always have it in change rooms, and you'd think because they're trying to sell the clothes, they would make it look good on you. It's crazy. Mm. Eh, that's too late. I've already built it that way. Um, the only annoying thing is, is this room is way lighter than the sides, so it looks kind of weird. Uh, hmm. I'm not sure what to do about that. Maybe we can just dim it in live mode. Okay, so I, I, I don't know if you were able to see while you were walking. But I saw things. I did a, a little, a few little junky things outside. I didn't do that much, but mostly did um, this little office area. Now, oh, yeah, that looks really this good. Is, oh, I, I want to see the duck. Hang on, let's go to live mode. I, I want to see what this looks like with the duck in there. I wish they had, like, a um, preview live mode feature. Why is it focusing on you and not me? I am the star of this show. <laughs> hey! Because I'm doing a um, ah, there we go. mukbang over here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, let me just get you here. Serious question, where do you put my completed Legos? I had to buy a whole shelf just to put them on. Um, and I'm going to have to actually start taking some of them apart because I've run out of space. So that's what happens with them. <laughs> that's just the library. Alright, so... Oh, yeah! <laughs> That's so cute with the little duckling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's put the walls up so we can see it. <laughs> That's really cute. Yeah. So they hang out in this room now, which is obviously way more detailed than before. And it's got like the flooding in it. It's got some gears and barrels. Oh, I'm so worried about their little legs getting caught. No, no, they'll be fine. This is their habitat now. They enjoy it. They said they like it in here. And we've got like cracks on the wall. Ooh, I, I got the uh, voting clothes. Cool. Um, yeah, so that's that. We got some ducting up top. Oh man, can can we have the ceilings like be changed in the game now? Yeah. It's been where are we now? This has been eight years of the game. I think. It's time. It's time. I wonder how hard it is for them to put it in the game. I don't know. I imagine anyway, it's not simple. There's that, and then the bathroom's got a little bit of junk in it too. I like the hand sanitizer. Yep. Although that's good. when you're putting that in and you're like, does this look weird? I was thinking Uh oh. I would have placed it a little bit further away from the mirror and further down personally. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too, but then that kind of also looked weird, so I just put it there. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. And then well that's oh yeah, so this whole room is actually up on a platform now and I don't know what to do about that. Oh. 
Because I had to be on a platform so I could get a door to the duck room. Uh, oh yeah, there's a rubber ducky there too. <laughs> I mean, you could not have a door. Yeah, but then it's kind of like, what is that room? Why wouldn't it not? The why? duck room. Yeah, yeah, but it's like an abandoned factory, so it would have been something. And people suggested it being like an, an old manager's office or something. You, I know you can put a shed door on the other side. So it looks like you got in there by a shed door. A roller door. Uh, could do. <laughs> or I could not. <laughs> yeah, are you able to come further forward just so we're sort of in the same I don't know if that chair can fit. It's a big chair. Just so we're sort of sitting in line so it focuses on both of us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that's a bit better. Um, yeah, and then I was just starting on... So this area... So this was kind of like the loading dock area. And I thought this is a kind of a cool way to have stairs going down. That it's like a so little, cool. I guess like some sort of storage room that they would have had. They come down here and it's like some sweet storage area that's all junky. That is so cool. And then down there, Whoa. down there, we'll do, well, <laughs> sorry, I'll stop doing that. We'll do like an entrance to like a sewer area. That's the idea. Um, oh yeah, so I want to change this light. Hey, I just thought of something really random, but really genius. Mm -hmm. We could, like... Okay, that did not change anything. Create a 5D stream, so everyone gets, like, little spray bottles and, like, vibrating things they hold. And then when things happen in the game, we're like, okay, we spray your bottle. vibrate. <laughs> so I just so realized the problem like, is these lights are actually putting light into this room for some reason. Mm. Maybe so, just have one on either side. So there's nothing I can do about it. But then these rooms are really dark. That's okay. It's not really okay. It looks a bit... You know, a lot of things vibrate and no, that no, it's doesn't not, mean no, anything. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Ah. Blah, blah. Blah, blah. No more. We don't need to talk about that. Okay. What if I make this? Oh no, because the arches. Hmm. Uh. Oh, even like this, it still has a weird lighting. Because I guess it pa passes through the arches. Hmm. I don't know what to do about that. It looks kind of not good. <laughs> Oops. Um. You could try a different kind of lighting, like a floor lamp. Um, instead of wall lighting, maybe try a ceiling light, or you could just dim them. Oh, I get what you mean. You don't want the sides being darker. Yeah, well, we. Oh, whoops. But they are already so. These lights are so dim, and it's producing more light than they put out. So it doesn't make any sense. But if I do this, try a different kind of light. It still does make the it like it doesn't make any sense. It makes the middle brighter than. Well, why don't you put the light on the wall separation so it goes into both rooms equally? The wall separation? Like, put it literally in the wall, the ceiling light. Oh, I get what you mean. So, yeah. That didn't work. Now it lights up that room. No, there. Do, do a couple. <laughs> there you go. That doesn't really work either. Oh, you did too <laughs> many. <laughs> no, but even undoing them, it's goofy. All right, we just got to do... Maybe, what about we only... <sighs> hmm. Oh, the humanity! <laughs> <laughs> okay, lighting is not great right now. I think a floor lamp might help. That wouldn't make a lot of sense, though. It could, because there could have been a squatter who had a little candle that they lit while down there. Maybe Batu lights. Batu saves all. Oh, Batu! Yeah! <laughs> Batu fixes it all. String bulbs. Yeah, actually, I don't hate that, <laughs> to be honest. Because it's kind of lighting it a little bit, a little bit better now. That actually kind of works. Yeah, that's not too bad. That uh, That's quite good. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that worked. All right, let's just go with that. All right, then. What is going on back there? 
Now, what kind of door should be here? So this is kind of like you're going into the actual sewer. I feel like it should like not be a door, but obviously a door you can go through. What about the big sewer from Batu? And so the deep sewer from Batu. The wall decor? No, but I need like a door you can go through. I guess we could do like, if we do like an archway, we could put something over it maybe. Like if I did that and then get the Batu thing, which I have up here. Yeah. But would that look weird? Hmm, it's not really fit. <laughs> I feel like there should be a way to, to get through, you know? That looks like it kind of... Spider, what if we just put a million spider webs? <laughs> what about a vault door? Whoa. Um, get together, metal door, base game one that's similar. Do a fence with a gate there. Ah, oh, you know what would be cool? That one that we had before? Mm. What do you mean, mm? Yeah, the, like, uh, oh, my cell God. fence with the door from get to work. Is that what you're thinking of? The cell fence? The jail cell fence with door. No, 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 the, um... It's like a debug thing. I don't know if it's live edit or not. Uh, live edit object. What pack? Does anyone know what pack that was from? I've forgotten. The one we pulled out before. I don't know what it was in. It might have been get together. Was it eco live cell? No. It was a good lifestyle. Or was it? Hmm. Hmm. What is this? Is ah. Oh. It was like that thing I thought was a sign, but it wasn't. Oh. Yeah, I don't know what that's from. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> maybe get famous. Yeah, maybe. I'm just gonna scroll. Ah, oh, satellite. Ah, oh, actually, I do need to put some more of this around the place. Where can this go? That's kind of copying what I did. Did you use this one from Strangerville? Video. Well, I did the whole group. Also, like video. I said, chat actually um, <laughs> did this build, so it's not me. Is that mismatched bricks at the back? I don't think so. I think it's just because of the way um, the stairs are here. Oh, right. It looks good. I was going to say that's copying me as well. Oh, it actually is different. It shouldn't be though. Oh, I think I know what happened because it's like a separate room. It probably changed the paint that was on the outside. I see. <laughs> Don't say it like that. <laughs> Beautiful. All right. Where was I? I got to go back all through the debug again. Did anyone figure it out? <laughs> um... Strangerville? Uh, it might be Strangerville actually. Although, I don't know where it would have been. I'll have a look. Sim Luna says it was eco. Eco? Okay, I'll have a look in a second. Um, yeah, I don't think it was Strangerville. No. For eco. It will look very good there, I think. Once we find it. Ah, <laughs> oh, dumpster. Actually, yeah, that's what we need here. Sorry, I keep getting distracted. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's better to put it there now than go looking for yeah. it again. Uh, let's see. There's those things. Uh, eco lifestyle. Hmm, no, I don't think it is eco lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Let's try to get to work. Another pack it could have been. That's what I originally said, I believe. Just saying. <laughs> I didn't say it wasn't this, I was just going with what chat said. No, it's well, not it's this. Not that, it's it's okay. not this anyway. City li oh actually it could be city living. That seems like a city living kind of thing. Or maybe cats and dogs even too. 
Maybe get together. Could be a get together thing. Could be anything. <laughs> I'm just listing all the packs. It's one of those things that could be in so many packs. Yeah. Okay. Uh, come on, baby. Show me. Show me oh, the oh, these are cool. money. Whoa. Doesn't really make sense for an old mill, though, but that's cool. <laughs> well, sometimes nope. old mills get turned into other things that True. are industrial. Try cats and dogs. Could be cats and dogs. Could be. Sorry, I know this is like super riveting content, everyone. And you know what? I'm going to find this item and I'm not going to like it. Is that, what's gonna, <laughs> is that what's going to happen? Maybe. Yeah, I feel like it will at this there, point. Is that it? No. Sorry, I got it. No, no, it's, it's getting close. It's, yeah. I feel, I sense it is close. No, it's not that close. <sighs> Wall deco get. Famous Parenthood, my first pet. It's not my first pet because I already found it just before. Could it be not tagged as a pack? It could it also be that. It could, yeah, it could be base game. Sometimes they do that. Yeah, I... Mm. Yeah, okay, get put, okay. You could go offline and then everyone could scrub back in the stream, find where but you can still go back out. in the stream if I'm not offline. I don't oh, have to go. You? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Not like if you're on the live page, but if you go to past broadcasts, it will already be there and you can just get back and watch it. While you're still live? Yeah. So you could like load up my past broadcast right now, even though I'm still live. Really? Yeah. I thought, um... Get some planks while I'm here too. What happens if you delete your past broadcast while you're still live? Well, then I will stop. <laughs> huh. Oh, okay. oh, I like those. Yeah, okay, which one should we use? Well, I'll scale it down, obviously. This one? This is not what no. I was looking for, but... No. That could make sense. Well, these are the three options, so... Okay, that's probably too big, so maybe like, whoops. Whoa. This size. That's cool. Wood mill. Yeah, that's exactly what it says. <laughs> it's a weed. It's kind of not in the center. I feel like it should be there, but <laughs> there's no roof there, so. Um, Maybe it should get. Should, hmm, I don't know. What should, what should we do with it? I just put a little to the right, so it was to always right. a little bit on the right. Yeah, I'd put it there. If it were me. Well, it's not you, so it's kind I'm of. I'm well aware of that, James. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Let's okay. It's not base game. I think I should just give up trying to find this thing now. <laughs> Maya said, "Get together." I'm. I just found it. I'm pretty sure. Okay, that was one of the other possibilities that we did mention. There were quite a lot of people saying "get together." <laughs> there it is. Yay! I don't really like this. You don't? <laughs> no, I do, but I don't know how I'm going to use it. Uh, it's pretty tall. Yeah. Uh, I was going to make the walls taller. I could do that. But then it makes it, oh, it makes that taller. Hang on, let me go out here so um, we can see it. Because it's such a cool item. That is really cool. Also, I don't know if Sims can actually walk through this. Because that is one of the requirements. We actually need the sim to be able to walk through it. So this could be like a solid thing. Hang on, let me see. Oh, wait, what is this? Travel to... Oh, it's like an actual thing. Oh. Oh, okay, yeah, so you can't walk through it anyway. So it wouldn't work no matter what. Okay, well, that was... Where is that in... I have no idea. Where is this? Does anyone know where this item is? <laughs> Apparently you can travel to the ancient ruins through it. Well, that was fun. All right, let's just put a door down here. <laughs> well, at least now we all know where it's from if we want to use it. So not a complete waste. No, it wasn't a complete waste. Why don't you just do like two steel posts and the industrial spandrel? Yeah, I could do that. Just like simple yet effective. And then we can put some junk around it. Yeah, junk it up. No, it's wood. Um... I think I need another coffee. I could use another coffee too. Really? Be the coffee girl. Do you want me to 
make one here or go drive somewhere? Uh, I don't know what our coffee situation is here. Like, I don't know if it needs to be, mm. like, the machine needs to be cleaned because we haven't used it in a few weeks. Well, I'm happy to take care of the stream and continue the build while you go. Okay. I actually need to go to the toilet, so you can entertain <sighs> whilst I do that. Yes. But if you get me banned... I, I won't. If you get me banned, I'm never streaming again because I can't. Ow. I won't. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> All right. Who wants to play footsies? No! <laughs> um, whoa. This teeth? Okay. Here we go. Hey, everyone. Thank you for such a warm welcome. Also, James can't hear himself through these, which is kind of interesting. Usually I can hear myself and I have one ear on, one ear off. So I'm like, I feel like I'm muted to you guys right now. Hi everyone, welcome to James's stream. Are you guys having fun? Are you enjoying enjoying it? Maybe we can put something. I feel like I want to add something down here, but obviously I don't want to ruin what we've done. So what could we put here? Maybe um, you're having a good time? Put baby Yoda, <laughs> the child. Uh, has to be something that James would approve of. Maybe we could put... What is this? A gonk droid? That kind of looks cool. I'm enjoying very much. I miss James streaming. Same. I wish James could stream regularly too. Um, but, you know... Some things just... Hi. I'm back. Oh. Hi. I was trying to put something in here that you would approve of. So yeah. I can Was it from Batu? Um, I looked at a couple of Batu things. <sighs> uh chat was saying the child. Uh no, that actually wouldn't be good in here. And yeah. that's not from Batu. That's from base game. I can't even see it. Oh now I can. <laughs> <laughs> just a teeny tiny That's pretty one. cute. That's cute. I feel like that might make someone happy if they see it. Aww. That's so nice. You do quick pee-pees. I do. Mm. Well, I mean, how long do you want me to take peeing? Well, I guess pee-pees don't take that long anyway. Yeah, I wash my hands. My hands are feeling cold. Oh, they're so dry. Aww. You can tell I wash my hands because of how dry they are. Cracking. <laughs> Yeah. Especially in winter. The stream first aid kit. Oh, Ow. it's the dregs. Oh no, the dregs. Oh yeah, this is an older one. Moisturizing. Now, James is a very clean, hygienic boy. Um, Thanks for letting them all know. <laughs> not, not, they don't really need to know the details of that. You were meant to get coffee too. No, that's your job. You're the <laughs> coffee girl today. I don't like being... I, I prefer streaming over getting coffee. Oh, you can go live then. If you go live, I'll go get coffee. <laughs> no. no. He is a clean, hygienic boy. He's very hygienic. Make sure to moisturize everybody. <sighs> Stay moisturized. All right, well, I'll let you, you get back to it. Also, you can't hear your voice through here. No. Oh. I'm not supposed to. <laughs> I mean, I always hear my voice. Well, it's because you like that. You like to listen to yourself. That is... <laughs> no, because on my one, um, it's a little bit delayed, so it's kind of... It's hard to talk, because it's like delayed by a fraction of a second, so when you hear your voice like that, it's really hard to talk. Right. Whoa! <laughs> good lord! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, good... Goodness me. Okay, well, I'll go get a coffee. Chat, can I get you anything? Put in your order now, so I know what I need to get on my coffee run. So what would you like, my Uh The usual, please. Weak flat white? Yeah, I'm doing weak coffees now. Oh, let's do beads. Uh, we don't have scones. We don't have cookies. Um, you'll take a co Ooh, cold brew. It's too cold for a Yeah, it's too cold for a cold brew. Matcha. It's funny we say it's too cold, but like... Most people is probably not. So Get us Bowser. 
<laughs> he's probably tired at the moment from his walk, isn't he? He had a big walk, actually. Yeah. He is so excited to be back. All right. Ah, here we go. This is what we need. Oh, these don't scale? That sucks. Oh, man. Do the floor ones scale? No. Nah. No. They're like mirrors. May I wonder if they made these from mirrors. <laughs> I got your orders. See ya, okay, babe. I'm just gonna get this chair out of the shot. Can I turn the heat on? Yeah. There we go. Dang. Uh, yes. Can I please turn on the heater? Uh, you may. It is permitted. <laughs> What's the average winter temperature? Uh, well, at the moment, I don't know if the overall average, but at the moment we're getting like maximum of 12 Celsius a day. So it's, I mean, it's like, like for places that actually get like cold, cold, it's not that cold. But for me, it's cold. <laughs> Some more goop on the walls. There we go. Um, yeah, I kind of wanted, oh, maybe there's like a, oh, what about, no, no, that'd be kind of weird. Why would there be a curtain? I was like, we could do a curtain. Oh, what about this? <laughs> laughing in Canadian. Yeah, look, so I don't like mentioning the temperature. It's cold for me, okay? When you're acclimatized to a certain temperature, when it's below that, it's cold. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh, Batu! <laughs> 12 sounds nice. 12 is cold, guys. Um... Maybe like vines. I kind of just want it to be, because this kind of needs to be like a, hmm, wonder, wait, how small can we make it? Like, I don't think a sim can get through that because of this, right? Oh, also that's a bit awkward. Oh, they can't go shorter. Okay, what about we do it a little differently? Because I kind of want it to be higher up, maybe not that high because I don't think they'll fit. But I want it to be like visually different to this. But how to do it? Hmm. What about this? So you go into this section and it sort of comes around the corner and then there's like sewer stuff back here. I don't know. Or we just have, okay, you know what? Hang on, let's do this. I'm gonna build, it's gonna go this way, okay? I don't know why, but it is. So we're gonna do this. I have side of the sewer, side of the sewer, and then it's gonna go up. We're gonna go one, two, one, two, one. So it's a little, oh wait, two. It's a little higher than this area, but hopefully still enough that they can get to it. And then with my other one, I had the columns uh, with my sewers that I built, like they were coming along here. I get, uh, see, I need to make the walls taller to be able to do that though is a problem. Cause I can't put columns. Hang on, where is it? <laughs> I can't see. I should probably put more lights in here. Even with move up, do I have move objects on? I always forget if I've turned it off or on. Okay, now it's off. Okay, so even with move objects, I can't place these here cause the walls are too short. Kind of wish it would just go all the way through. What about... Um, oh, they place up high. I kind of want it to be lower. Hmm. Can I place columns if we're a little lower? Just a smidge. No, it has to be the whole wall. Dang it. Okay, well, maybe we just go floor height then. <laughs> it's probably, the, oh, actually, that's not even going to work, is it? Because the, oh, wait, no, it does. Okay, so this now places on the ground. Okay, okay, let's just do this then. It'll be the same height as the ground, but we'll have the sides sort of raised up a bit. Uh, I'll figure that out in a second. All right, let me get some temporary lighting. 
Yeah, I know I had to lower the room. I just didn't want to. I kind of wanted it to be shorter, but that's all right. We'll just work with that. Okay, so we're going to come through here. Um, I guess... Well, I'll make this at least line up with that. Uh, so this is like an entrance, and then I guess so is this. Maybe we could do... What if this sewer like flowed, like it went here and then it like went down more? Oh, is this the bug I was talking about? <sighs> okay, so remember I was mentioning earlier there's a bug where you couldn't see through to the basements from above? It doesn't let you see through to an, a lower level basement from the basement, which is so annoying because you used to be able to do that. I kind of wanted it to look like the, maybe the sewer went down and goes underneath somewhere. And then you could like sort of step, like climb into it. Hmm. Maybe we could just put a, let's put a grate there. That'll, that'll work. Down to the nether. Yeah, we can do like a nether portal down there. Let's just do a grate though. Let's do like one of these. There. That, that looks super realistic, doesn't it? <laughs> that's, that's super real. Can't you tell how real that is? Um, is there a better one than this? <laughs> Do we, do we have a better option than this? The glass floor does work, but then it looks shiny. Like, I, I, I want it, you to be able to see through it. There's this one, but then that's like tiny. So I don't know if that's any better. There's a Batu one! I gotta find that. Also, I'm like trying not to sneeze really hard right now. <laughs> Alright. Batu. What do, you, what do you got for me, Batu? Is it in here? Oh, Batu. Yeah! Saving the day, Batu. That actually does look better. That's maybe too big, but that one I think works. Yeah! Let's go! All right, let's, I'm gonna move these back to there and then we'll figure out the rest. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna have, so this is like the end of this sewer, but obviously this is where we'll enter it. So I'm going to do a wall, maybe a half wall. That's too big. That's too big. That's too big. That's too big. That's maybe just right. We're going to go here. I'm going to go maybe up to the column. So I guess the idea, like, I don't, this doesn't make any sense in <laughs> this is a, this is not how sewers work. Just, just so you know, this is not an educational, um, tutorial on building sewers. This is purely just so it looks kind of cool and serves no function because this makes zero sense. It looks cool though. Exactly. Exactly. And that's all we really care about. So, <laughs> all right. Now, what did I, did I do a different flooring on here? Do we have a better flooring for the sewer? Yeah, we got this one that's kind of cracked. I feel like we need more like cracked up flooring in this game as well. Oh, Batu. Yeah. No, that's not real. I guess I could just add some floor cracks down. Am I going to stream more? Well, I'm still streaming right now. If you mean in general, I mean, I will be doing another stream at some point because today was supposed to be um, a sponsored stream with a special guest. Unfortunately, we had to reschedule that. Um, so stay tuned. I will, I will post about that like on Twitter and YouTube uh, when we figure that out. So that will happen, hopefully, anyway. Um, I mean, look, if schedules don't line up, it might not happen, but ideally we're gonna make it, we're gonna try and make it happen. So stay tuned for that. So there, there will be another stream um, at some point, <laughs> but I can't say when right now because we haven't figured it out. Deli is an extra special guest, but she was not the special guest that we were talking about. Ah, oh, poor prince. Oh, they should have, you know, they should have added um, werewolf prince. That would have been cute. <laughs> Around the place. I'm going to do some here. Oh, like scratches down here. That's kind of cool, actually. I'm actually really glad this shows up above that. Oh, oh, God. Hang on, let me do it over here. Uh, 
Was it Gluon? <laughs> no, Gluon wasn't the special guest. No, 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 it's all right. Well, um, yeah, stay tuned. We'll, we'll figure that out. I might do... Can I do, like, a shorter... <laughs> I joined Twitch because of you four years ago. You streamed probably four times. Look. Oh, God, I hate that half-wall bug as well. I used to stream more, and now I stream less. And that's just the way the cookie crumbles. Um, so, it just... That's the way it is. Does that look weird? I, I really wish it was just an angled wall, but... It does look weird, doesn't it? Does it look better or what? You know what? Let's maybe change the whole thing. Let's do... Where's the... I want to use... Oh, actually, we could use the, this fence. I do like that fence. Oh, we could use the new fence. Uh, which is in here somewhere. Here it is. Looks better. Half wall or fence? Well, I feel like that should maybe... Because, I mean, the idea... Look, the thing is, if water was flowing down here, <laughs> it would definitely just flood this entire space. It doesn't make any sense. Um, so let's not worry about it being realistic. We just want it to look good. What about... Oh, Batu fence. Oh, yeah. Oh, that would definitely... Yeah, there's a huge gap there. What pack is that fence from? That's from the werewolves pack, the new pack. Oh, this one? This one's from um, Get to Work. The very first expansion pack. That's also a good one. Barrier things in debug eco living. Hmm. Potentially. There's potential. Debugging. There's also good barriers and stuff in the werewolves debug too. So let's have a look at that. Oh, tree. What else we got? I don't know what these are. Ah, oh, stumps. Whoa. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh, dirt pile. Heck yeah. Dirtin. Just gotta put some of these in here. <laughs> uh, what else we got? We got a tire, some junk, some wood. Some of those, this thing. Where's that, um... Oh, actually, this would be good in here. So this will turn on at night, right? Yeah, it has that sort of illumination at night. That's kind of cool. I mean, it doesn't produce light, but it looks cool. What about, could we do this at the end? Maybe that makes sense. But then it'd need to be lower is the problem. Uh, if I had the tool mod, we could like rotate it, put it on the ground. That'll look cool. Oh, what about, wait, where's the other ones? Where's the other stuff? Um, oh, oh, hello? Did I go past them all? Okay, I'm, well this is cool, I like this. I'm gonna put that down, because I might use that in a second. Hmm, as a... There's Greg's house. Wait, where's the portal stuff? I feel like I must be scrolling straight past it, right? Why do I not have them here? I'm confused. I feel like I am losing my mind. Not really, but also, where are the things? <laughs> Where's the entrances? Did I not do both cheats? Oh, I don't think I have. Hang on, show. Oh, hidden objects. Did I not do the... Ah, okay, maybe that was why. Wait. Hmm. Oh, wait, yeah, here we go. Yeah, okay, I didn't have this cheat on. Okay, so this one could actually work better. Visually, anyway. So I have to scale it down like that. Look, it, it also looks kind of weird because it has it has a door on it. Like a really little door. But we could potentially put this here. That kind of makes more sense to me. And it probably looks better. Let's get rid of that half wall. Do 
we keep the great? We could keep the great. And then it actually also means that you can enter. I might just line it up with this. You could enter the. Oh. Oh, that's oh, that's okay. I hate when that happens with rocks. <laughs> hmm. Let me just make it smaller. Oh. So the thing with rugs is because they, they render on the ground um, no matter what. So all that happens is when you move it up, it still renders on the ground, but because it's like at a higher place, it like projects it weirdly. So it's kind of like trippy. <laughs> yeah, that's not going to work. But yeah, what do, what do we reckon about that? I think that's probably better, right? I think I like that better. I'm gonna go trash bag here. I like it. Yeah, I think that works. Let's go with this. Okay. We're getting we're getting somewhere now. Oh yeah, I've left this here. Um you know what? I'll put this here. Hello. Hi. Hi, James. Does this have any branding on it? For privacy sake. Uh, it doesn't. It's got a cute little picture. I did it. see something on it, but I don't think you'd be able to see it anyway. Um, this is what I did. So you come in here, so it goes around the corner. And then this is like the end of the sewer, I guess. So this is like I put this here. Oh, that's I cool. guess, I don't know, stuff would go in or out of there. Because I wanted to actually have it go down, but you can't open a basement to the lower level still for some reason. Right. Oh, actually, if I make, cause I, I was saying it would have been cool to add a werewolf footprints. Oh. But I, I, I was just like, why don't we just make this bigger? That is cool. There we go. <laughs> that is, I really like that. That's kind of cool. Clever. Okay, so that's good. Then we just need to build out a little sewer network and have some rooms down here. You forgot to bring Bowser, said chat. <laughs> oh. Is he open to moving yet, or is he still not moving? I mean, he's pretty happy just guarding at the window like he usually mm, does. Good boy. So I'm going to build out this way. So this is just building out the sewer network now. I'm going to have it joined to this one. I don't think I'll actually like open it visually, but I'll have it like sort of joined through the wall there. This is my plan. You're turning so this into city skylines. Yeah. Sewer network. So what I want to do is I want to do a few little rooms basically down here. Um, so we want to do, so I was saying if you missed the beginning of the stream because it was a while ago, but when you go through the underground, like through the portal potties or some of the other ones, you get a little pop up saying you've reached this room or you're in this room and this happened, blah, blah, blah. So I want to do a few of those like little rooms just for fun. So like one of them is the frog army. So I want to have like a little room that just has a bunch of frogs in it. <laughs> so that's, that's what I want to do. I'm going to have this actually go all the way to the end. And then we'll just do like maybe at the end of a sewer grate there or something. And then we'll have a little frog army room off to the side. I kind of feel like the frog army room should be like this. Oh, that has to be three wide. That's a bit weird. Oh, that's fine. Whatever. This is going to be the frog army room. Yeah. Oh. Are you taking my old coffee? My dregs? Yeah, I really like sipping your dregs. Ew. <laughs> that was a joke, just to make that really clear. I don't know that it was. There's a kernel of truth to every joke. Mm, I like kernels. Okay, so a gonna... kernels are only on corn. No, that um, chocolate thing we had the other day had peanut kernels. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I was going to say, if it's only on corn, it should be called cornels. Boom, boom. <laughs> uh, what's the door called to the, the sewer area? Well, actually, you know what? I need to test this. Let's go back to Lumo because I'm I still got my sim here. Can I enter the sewer through this? I, it looks like I can, but I don't know if I can because it's quite small. Oh, it's a cute little doorway. Does it work? Oh, it actually does. That's kind of cool. All right, so we don't need to do another one. We can just do the visual ones. <laughs> right back there, just sitting in the uh, 
Oh, Frog City, this is what I'm talking about. This is what we're building. <laughs> so, this... What does that sound? Oh, is that outside? Why are you sitting so creepily? <laughs> I don't know. You... I was trying to figure out what Frog... What the Frog City thing It's was. from the underground, when you, like, explore. Uh, yeah. What do you mean? I wasn't sure what you were referring to when you said that's what I'm talking about. Sorry, Frog was... City, because that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Because that's what we're building right now. Okay, whoa. Um, <laughs> so wait, let's, we got to read this description because we got to recreate this. Hang on, let me go, if I go here, and then, no, no, if I go here, and then here, then I go here. There we go, we can zoom in a little bit. All right, somewhere ahead, the repetitive creak of metal echoes towards the marsh, followed by a slush slosh of water. Okay, we need water. We've got to slush slosh it. Um, as it repeats, Samaj begins to speculate what might, what it might be. Wait, okay, let me read that properly. <laughs> I'm going too fast. I'm too excited. Calm down. Sorry. <laughs> Deep breath. <laughs> Samaj begins to speculate that it might be a water pump when he stumbles into a room filled with frogs. <laughs> it's almost a proper frog city. There aren't just the common kind either. Someone's been breeding them. Well, at least the frogs seem happy down here. So that. That's what you're talking about. That's what I'm talking. Oh, what? okay. We can get out of the underground now. Okay, so look, it's not going to be like a, a. We're not going to build like a city. I'm just going to do some shells and probably have a bunch of frogs in here. That's really what we're going to do. All right, let's get some little light so we can see what's going on. And then we, we, I guess we should figure out how we actually want to light up this area because it should be dark, but not like pitch black so you can't see. Because part of the underground is that it, that it is dark, you know? But we still want to be able to actually see what we're doing. We'll figure that out. Alright, let's go up on this. So this will be the same height as this little side bit. And then I need to go debug. I need to get the sewer end piece again. We'll go to... Werewolves. James, save. Uh, I don't really save. It's just not my style. <laughs> How does that really do that? So this will go here. Yeah, so that's just like the end, you know, it doesn't really go anywhere. Now we need a slush, slush of water. How could we do that? Because we can't... We, I mean, we could do like a pool. But does that look weird? Like if we... Ignore that it just stops there, but if we put like... Uh, where is it? I like that. With the right water. Must be applied to pools or fountain. That is... Oh, I think I have to go down a level. No, not that many leaves. Like, does... Is that weird? Having... Having it like that? Let me just paint it. Or are we okay with that, having that sort of water there? It would have to just end somewhere though. Probably here somewhere. So, I mean, I guess it would go... Hang on, I have to go down here and move it. Wait, did that... I mean, what happened? Did I just delete... I think I deleted the room. <laughs> I think it's okay because you can't really see how deep it is. So just imagine it's shallow. <laughs> Ideally, it wouldn't actually be deep, but we can't really change that, so... But this will open here, obviously. Now, how should we... How do we transition this? Because it's not gonna... Continue all the way to this thing, I don't think. I mean, I guess we could do that. Maybe we should. It means we won't be able to access this, though. Do we want to access it, or do we not want to access it? I mean, I'm just trying to fix these walls. Okay, that... <laughs> That whole thing was to remove the platform. It's still there. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Let's do this way. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty then. Okay. So let me just build the potential option so we can see what it looks like. I'm trying to get rid of these little... Okay. No, I want the paw prints. No, no. The... No, no. No, no. No, no. No, no. No, no. No, no. Oh. There we go. Over there. 
Yeah, the pond tool only works on ground level. You can't use it in the basement. Otherwise, yeah, I would use that. Oh, I moved the wrong thing. I have to go down. Um, and likewise, you can't use the fountain tool down here either. Otherwise, again, I would use that. So if this goes all the way here. So we could do that, for example. And obviously this joins. Actually, you know what? I do wonder. What if I... Hang on, if I teleport here... Oh, we can't get in because he can't step down. What if I tell... Oh. I wanted to see if he could swim <laughs> into it. <laughs> that would be fun. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if that would work. But I feel like maybe if I can get into the pool, maybe it would work. So what if I put this here? Can I get into this? Yeah, I don't think we even better click on it, so I feel like it's not... Boating well. <laughs> yeah, let's just go here and then swim. There you go. Let's swim over here and go to the underground. Okay, no, it doesn't work. <laughs> so it would be purely decorative if that was the case. Oh, okay, let's just, uh, let's just reset that. Yeah, I know it's because of the platforms you couldn't get in there. Um, well, what do we reckon? Do we want to do this or do we want to have it like it was before? And then have, we could have some water in the rest of it, but maybe just have like, I don't know, some thing over the top of it. You like this. Okay, well, let's go with this then. Yeah, I, I do like it too. I think it looks cool. Um, maybe we should change the, uh, the trim of the platforms though. Like a stone, maybe? Or I guess really it should be a brick, but there's not really... Like, oh, that looks weird. Oh, wait, can we do a pool trim as well? Hang on. Because that, <laughs> that looks kind of fancy. It's got like this trim on the top and the bottom. But just... We could do a bigger stone trim. Mm. Or we just leave it grey. Concrete. Because that's just like sort of a concrete edge. Maybe this one actually would be better. Oh, it is actually this one anyway. Do a darker one. Let me just see if I can do a pool trim as well. Will it let me do that? I change it to like a darker color? Oh, it does. Okay, that's good. So we can at least hide the edge a bit more. That's better. Let's just do that. Now, I'm not sure how navigating this sewer pool is going to work because hang on uh hello oh <laughs> it's all the way down there that's not what i wanted so this goes to here all right so these walls also shouldn't be here i don't know why they're there because we would have to do like some sort of bridge. Otherwise he's going to have to walk all the way around and come back. As I'm not really sure, sure what the best way to do that is. But yeah, I reckon this will be cool. And you can't really build bridges over pools. So it's not like we could just build a cool looking bridge and you can walk over it. Like what could, what could we do? Because if we wanted to get to this frog city, which will be here. He could get there, he just has to go all the way around. What do we reckon? A grate slash fence uh, for bridge. You know what, actually that's not a bad idea. I, so I think what you mean is if we go, let's remove that. So there's, there'll just be no pool there. Let's do the same pool trim as well though. And then if we did like what am I doing? Um, uh, what am I doing? Platform. Yeah. And then we just decorate this middle section to have like the grate on it. <laughs> I like your concentration face in the background, Dali. You do. Yeah, like, mm -hmm. so, so and then we put like this around. over it. And then maybe if I change, can I individually change this platform to have a different trim on it? Because that might work. Uh, where's the... It's actually a cheap fence, isn't it? Yeah. We get this. 
And then, yeah, we need to change the trim so it's separate. But how do I... Maybe I just need to disconnect it quickly. I do this and then change it. Hmm. Mm. Oh, wait. I need trim. Okay, not that. Uh, what would it... Whoa. I was just looking at um, maybe I'm tempted to grow black truffle. It takes how, three to four years. Say, how long does that take again? To harvest. So I'm like, are we going to be here for three to four years? <laughs> there? Someone else will get to harvest some sweet black truffle. Well, they won't know they're there because you have to sniff them from under the ground. <laughs> and also macadamia. It would be really cool to grow a macadamia tree. But macadamia is really yeah, we toxic can... <laughs> to animal, uh, to dogs. So. We can train Bowser to be a truffle dog. I know. Because he's kind of like a piggy. <laughs> Yeah, I reckon he'd sniff it out. <laughs> that looks good, you reckon? Like, say, like this? Oh, obviously, you know the fence blocking this bit. Let's get rid of that. What do you reckon about that for, like, a little... I like it. Because it, it kind of looks like it goes under. Yeah, I think that works. I think that looks very nice. I'm going to move these here. And extend... Whoa. Chat likes it, too. As long as chat's I mean, I feel like happy. chat really built this lot, so... They did. It's really, For it's, a second, you think you did? But You're I out did. of line. Now, did we want to do spandrels down here too? Or is that going to be too much? Because, I mean, we've got a low ceiling. Um, I'm not sure if that's going to be... Maybe just in this section. The starting area. Although that one looks weird. Get rid of that one. Maybe just here? I don't know. Also, it's a different color than the fence, so maybe I should change that. Oh, you know what? It would be cool as well. Just having like little side rooms. Mm -hmm. So similar with the arches, there's like a little cutout that, I don't know, would have junk in it or something. Maybe pipes or something, some access pipes or so something, you know? I don't know. I don't know what would be in there. Little control unit. Yeah, something. just some junky stuff. Uh, do some some junky pipes here and then we need like uh where's that get to work oh like this kind of thing like a little control box here too i don't know what it does but it does stuff and that's what's important oh i need to raise it up it's all just atmosphere you know mm. you know it would be cool uh to have actual like accessible tunnels like you, when you like enter the tunnels, you actually go somewhere. And it's like a kind of like you know in World Adventures, like the tombs, and you like sort of unlock and go through. Oh yeah. Well, I guess kind of like um, Jungle Adventure. If they had like that system, and the and because with the, the Jungle Adventure two, oh, not tombs, the um, temples, they sort of randomize to different ones. So it'd be cool if you went into the the tunnels, and every time you got like a different combination. That would be. That'd be sick. I feel like they should use that system more. Sir, so I actually thought when you went to the underground sewer network, sometimes you'd end up in the hangout you built underground. I did. I think you might have to be loaded onto that lot, though. Oh, okay. Because I don't, I don't think it will travel you there. Right. Actually, I might have this more out in the open because this one's kind of cool. With the valve. So, yeah, when I, when I was loaded on that lot, my sim did actually pop into there, which is kind of cool. When I was loaded onto the bar lot, my sim actually popped out into the, uh... That's cool. Into the hangout. I like that. We need a filter for junky, junky stuff? Yeah, they should have, like, for the style filter. It should be, like, junk. Should be one of them. That'd be good. That should be handy. I'm gonna move this back, I think. We could get a pig if we grew truffles. Um, what's the lore around that, about having a pig on... Uh, Around here, Let yeah, house see. in the suburbs. I don't know that you can just have a pig. Can I have a pig? Like a fully grown pig, not like a little pig. <laughs> okay, well now we need to. Okay, that's okay. Well, I think we're getting somewhere, you know. Definitely need some more like things on the wall. I reckon. Maybe no. Oh, we're not allowed a pig? Uh, I'm not surprised. Because Can you know how annoying that would be if the neighbors even, had pigs? You can't even have a pig here if you have 10,000 square meters. 
of land. Not that, that we have that much, but I'm just saying. No, we have 20,000, obviously. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <gasps> oh my god, we can't even have a rooster, I guess, because it would disrupt That would be the so loud. No, that's good. I don't want our neighbors to have roosters. <laughs> We're allowed. You can have chickens, but you can't have roosters, I think is the thing. How big? What do we live on? I don't even know. Um, I think. Wow, we're technically only allowed two dogs. Really? Yeah. No, I mean, I guess that makes sense. You don't want people having like 50 dogs on their property. You're only allowed two dogs and two cats here. We're not allowed a horse or donkey. Wait, so you can have two dogs and two cats? Or, yeah. Well, then why can't we have four dogs or four cats? You can only have... This is really strict. I'm leaving. This place is... <laughs> <laughs> I think we can have poultry, fowl, or similar. Yeah, I, I just... Uh, the rooster rule makes sense, because <laughs> that would be bad. Uh, there are donkeys time to move. Let's see, I need some wall That's decorations. Wild. I don't think it's that wild. I don't really want our neighbors just having livestock. I would love it. Would, would, no. That would be so nice seeing like piggies next door. <sighs> no. <laughs> Why would that be bad? It'd be loud, it'd be smelly. <laughs> they wouldn't be loud. Okay. They wouldn't be smelly. <laughs> okay, yeah, they would be. Makes it. You know, contrary to what people think, pigs are very emotional and clean animals. And smelly. Is this too many? I think I might be doing too many. I'm just placing stuff. Yeah, that's too much. You can see how much it repeats. Let's. We can do a few, but maybe not that many. Oh, my cat just did a stanky poop next to me. Yeah, pigs are really clean. Yeah, that's great, but the the pen and stuff will still smell. The pigs themselves might be clean, but that doesn't mean the thing that they're in is clean. Just go to farmland if you want a pig. I don't want our neighbors having pigs everywhere. It's too much. I just can't believe we can only have two dogs. That is surprising, actually, because I feel like people have way more than two dogs. Yeah, people definitely don't follow that rule. Well, I guess that would that have to, though, because unless you don't register your dog, because if you've registered your dog, then no, so... No, oh, I don't think they follow up on it. No, but you literally have to register it with the council, so then they would know how many dogs you have at that address. Yeah, but they're not going to actually go find people unless they have, like, ten dogs, probably. Uh, let's not find out. <laughs> they are so easy to clean out. Pigs, they never go bathroom on their bedding. Oh, they're like chow chows! That's crazy. Well, actually, like most dogs. <laughs> I like think most animals usually is that, don't go to the toilet where they live. Where chat lives, can you guys just get a pig? Like, is it this strict in it's, other countries? Yeah, in the suburbs, you can't just get livestock and have it in your garden. I always wondered why there weren't more, <laughs> like, pigs and things around. <laughs> you just can't Wait, do that. Wait, they didn't specifically say alpaca, so maybe we could get an alpaca. I'm wondering how we do the door here to... Uh... Um, oh, we can have a secret bookcase door. No one will know it's Whoa. there. <laughs> oh, bad too. Whoa. I mean, if it didn't have like the the lights on it, it probably would be like a good sewer door. But mm. to look, what do you mean? Mm. It's a it great sewer door. Slightly it's like, futuristic. That's what I was saying. If it didn't have the lights, it would look because it just looks like a metal door. No pigs in apartments. What about miniature pigs? Well, How funny is it that so many people like jumped on the miniature pig? It's sad. Trend. The poor pigs. And then the pigs weren't miniature. They just grew into full-blown pigs. Yeah, that's so sad. Yeah, it is sad for the pigs. They're such emotional animals, too. Oop. Oh, I thought I nearly deleted it. You know what I'm going to do? Not a door. I'm going to do a gate. How about that? You like them How apples. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. We're going to do that. Does that stick out of the ground? Oh, it does. <laughs> One of my friends next door, there are two goats. They're probably not legally allowed to have the goats, but they've been there since the people before them lived there. So they sold the house and then left the goats there, and now the new people take care of the goats. But the goats can climb fences, so sometimes the goats will like climb over to her house and like chase her back inside. Yeah, that's, that's why it's not good to have 
So it's kind of animal. Oh, okay. All this stuff is like sticking out of the ground. Oh, that's okay. We'll cover it with plants. Oh, in Indonesia, we're allowed bike bike soldier. That's awesome. Very very good. Covering. There we are. Well, um, how am I meant to grow my? How am I meant to harvest my truffles if I can't have a pig? I should take this to council. This predicament. Okay, have fun. To say what I'm growing truffles. What do you want me to? That'd be do? like um, you actually can't grow truffles under this legislation, and you'd be like, oh. <laughs> I cannot harvest my truffles. <laughs> I must have a pig. Yeah, this is looking pretty cool. If I do say so Rent myself. A pig. Uber pig. Remember, you need a water pump near Frog City. True. What would a water pump even look like? Like, what should I use for that? I also need to adjust the lighting in this place so it looks more like a sewer. Isn't there like a water pump looking thing in Get to Work from one of those like industrial decoration Probably. Places? Oh, this light here. This is a sewer light if I've ever seen one. Oh, I love that light. I'd like a real grubby version of it. Yeah, like smudged over and you mm. can't really see it. Mm-hmm. Mm. Let's go for that light. Dirty light. What? There are entire dog breeds that are bred to be truffle hunters. Okay, how to train my dog. How to train dog. I think we should have like a frog so city light. Truffles. Nah, that's pretty good. Nice and dark. Let's get rid of these lights too. Let's get the mood going in here, you know? Oh yeah, that's better. That's, that's looking more sewery now. Actually, is there any... What can we put in the water? Well, those probably wouldn't grow. I want like um, what a log. Ducks, unidentified submerged object. Oh yeah, we got to have that. Uh, firefly. Oh, that'd actually be kind of cool. But I mean, they wouldn't be in a sewer. Would mosquitoes go in a sewer, or is that just no? They wouldn't be there, would they? Because what would they be eating? Yeah, I was thinking alligator too. The problem is it's too big, because it, it has to be... Well, it doesn't have to be. Obviously, we can move, use move objects, but it would end up swimming through the floor a lot. But maybe we could do a bigger section somewhere that opens up, maybe? Uh, Tadpoles? We could do some tadpoles, maybe. Especially near Frog City. Actually, that makes sense. Tadpoles near Frog City? Yes. Yes. 100%. And why is that, James? Because they become frogs. That's right. Well, actually, they become... Do they go straight to frogs or is there another stage? I don't remember. They go tadpole to frog. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I can scale down the alligator. <laughs> I don't know if the actual alligator scales down. We'll find out. We'll see what happens. Um, rats. Oh yeah, what's the rat object? How do I get those again? I just said rat. Definitely need rats. Where do I get the rats? Someone let me know. Let me go to live mode. I want to see what this stuff looks like first up. Okay, so we should have, I guess, some bubbles around the place. Like maybe over here somewhere. I actually kind of like as well because this is all on like we're on a platform. He actually can't swim in here, so it actually stops him swimming in it autonomously, which is good. Because otherwise, it might look a little goofy <laughs> having Sims swim around down here. <laughs> okay, I'm not seeing anything yet. It's also really dark, so I guess it is kind of hard to see. Oh wait, there's some tadpoles there. I think yeah, Aww. it's really hard to see because it's dark, but they're there. I don't know how well you guys can see that. No alligator yet. Oh, oh my god! Whoa. Okay, you know how I said it'd be goofy if Sims are swimming? I think they might have popped out of the sewer. <laughs> hmm, okay, we might <laughs> we might need to change that to the decorative one. That's fun though. But they can't get out. Open. Uh, so if we stayed in this lot, that just drown. Oh, that's kind of cool there. Is it? Oh, an identified thing down there. That's creepy. They got okay. gators. You know, I thought that was more bubbles, but I that's kind of cool but I don't think it really works. So you can see how deep the water is then. Let's get the bubble stuff because there is a bubble object. 
which is like the little crack things. Where are those? How to make... Oh, here we go. These things. Bubbles, yeah. How to make a graveyard. Step one, download <laughs> the sewer. <laughs> Death Lower the bridge? Yeah, but I, I don't want to because then... It'll be too close to the water height, so it wouldn't even really like. It looks like it should flood, and also, then I'd have to remove the fence for people to be able to get out of the pool. So I don't really want to do that. Can I just reset you? Okay, I can't. Hmm. Ah, Batu cheats. Get Batu items. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Okay. Well, what I can do is just. Add you to my family and then teleport you. And then reset you. And then remove you from my family. There we go. Okay, so I think we might have to remove this. Because <laughs> if werewolves are just going to appear out of this... You know, we're getting a little laggy. Let's hit save. Let, you know, it's been... How long has it been? Two and a half hours? We should probably hit save. Um, I really liked that as an end piece because it sort of sits in the water. So I'm not really sure what to do now because the other one... Kind of sits above the water. I mean, I guess it's kind of dark in here, so maybe you can't really see it that well anyway, so maybe it's okay. Could raise the floor in front of the sewer. Like this area, maybe. I don't really... I don't want to have access to this pool because I don't want Sim swimming in it because it looks silly because really the sewer is supposed to look like it's shallow not like super deep <laughs> so if Sims end up swimming through it it's going to look not how I want it. Why don't you just put the big fencing around it? The big fencing? Yeah like the new big fencing from werewolves. Um, because I don't know how that would work around the pool so they can't jump in well they can't get in the pool anyway and that was the problem oh, okay. they can't get out of the pool because they just come through the sewer thing that's why i need to change it to the other one right because they, they won't swim because they can't get into it but if they appear in it from the tunnel then they get stuck i see the problem yeah i see your predicament let's just use this we're going to use this and we're going to put a wall behind it so it's just going to be a big thing that's here hang on let me move these well. I know it's really dark. I don't know if it's annoying to watch. That's why I like to have more lights when I'm actually building, but I feel like we're getting the atmosphere now. So I'm going to put walls around this section. Maybe this should be like a different... Maybe it should be like more metal looking. Mm. Why can't I... Yeah. Okay, it's not... I just want to... Okay, okay. Just... just Okay. Bowser! Here he comes. Might have to move the pool and put the pool back. Okay, can't move pool under wall apparently, whatever that means. I'm moving it away from the wall, what are you talking about? <laughs> okay, let's do that. Bowser! Okay, that's the end of it there. The sides kind of look a bit weird because you can see through it, so I guess we'll just put stuff in front of it. I like Bowser's recall, it's really good. Yeah, it's very good recall. <laughs> He is a chow, after all. They are notorious for just not coming when called. I'm going to get rid of this parking barrier because it doesn't really make any sense down here. I don't even know how it would be down here. So this wall... Yeah, metal. There we go. So it's just like that instead. Oh, actually, you know what I will do? Because I just want this to be decorative. Oh, it kind of goofs up the columns. That's all right. I'll just get rid of those. <laughs> then when you put the walls down, it stays up. Sweet. Now we just need to put some stuff on the side so you can't see through it. Now this... I don't know why I'm, <laughs> I'm just choosing a chimney. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, can you raise up the bottom of the pool so, it's, so it sits in the water? Oh, uh, yeah, you know what? Probably could do that. Because that's kind of what was happening. <laughs> and I, for some reason, that didn't cross my mind to just do this. That's actually not a bad idea. Probably makes more sense. 
So then it's like submerged in the water. Like that. And then we just have to put some stuff on the side. But what do we put on the sides is the question. Just random junk, probably. Stone wall. Sure. Does that have a better car? Uh, that's a bit <laughs> that's a bit weird. Let's not do that. <laughs> Overgrowth plants. Yeah, that was the other that's the other option. Plants always hide all the sins. Ah. Oh. Any Batu things I can put down here? Oh my gosh. Batu. Come on, I just wanted to go there. I don't think they can get past that. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's go, yeah, let's try some plants. Some po oh! Do bug plants. Okay, now we need like um something thin. Oh. Yeah, we might actually just have to go into debug because some of these are just going to be like kind of... Can I even walk past this if it's here? Like, also just a bit weird. Yeah, let's try some vines. Like, if we do these sort of more disheveled ones, I quite like. If I just like layer them a little bit. What if I... Okay. 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 I mean, I could also just put a wall there. That's the other, that is the other option. But... I mean, you can't... It's dark. I could probably get away with that. Especially on this side. I can't really see what's going on at all. I feel like maybe just a little bit more on top. I go. Hang on. I think I have to raise it all the way through it, through the pool. Just a little bit, just at the back. Does that look weird? I mean, you can't really see it. So that's kind of helping. Make this smaller. I go here. The trick is just turning off all the lights. Oh, this green one, I think it's a bit too much there because it's kind of sticking out. Oh, this one. Yeah, yeah, this dead bush from vampires is good. There's like a miscellaneous growth. Ooh, ooh, there we go. Yeah, just a little, little bit of something, something. That's, that's good. That is good. Um, I feel like we definitely need more light in this area. Yeah, that works. <laughs> Some margin of werewolf just hanging out down here. Are right, these werewolf footprints? They're not werewolf footprints. I'm just calling them that. We'll put them here in the side bit. Okay, th that should mean we don't have Sims just spawning in the water. So there's that. Okay. Now, Frog City. <laughs> we need a water pump. So where do you say there was maybe a water pump thing, Dali? Um, in Get to Work. There's okay. like a thing that goes onto the floor with a wheel in it that looks like a water pump. Get to work. Uh, yeah, that, uh, that one maybe? There's an industrial pipe, which uh, I mean could be a pump. You don't know what it is. We can just pretend maybe it's a maybe pump. Maybe that, or there's another one I was thinking of. There's this thing. There's one more in, that yeah. goes into the floor. There's this thing? Yeah, that. Looks so like a water this? pump. Oh, it, is, it says Hydro Mixer 4000. Oh my god! Man, I'm a genius. Should yeah. we have it by the door or like in the room? Maybe like here. You are a genius, Deli. Thank you. You know, sometimes they may ask if cobs are only on corn. But then I'll have a eureka moment like this. Cobs? You mean, didn't you say kernels? Kernels are only on corn. <laughs> oh, God. 
Just don't listen. Maybe I should leave the room. <laughs> okay, now how do we do Frog City? Obviously we need all the frogs, but how should they... Like, we need some shelves that they can, like, sit on, right? Uh, surfaces or shelves is the question. Yeah, and what... I mean, it's got to look kind of jank, though. Like, we, you can't just be, like, nice-looking shelves. It's a miscellaneous. So a fro should we have a frog experiment table? Yeah. What? Okay, no. Me. I'll take that as a no. And no frog experiments. Flashbacks to school science classes. We never had to do it on anything that was like fully intact, but we did do like heart stuff. Just kind of, I didn't like that. I actually I'm not good left with that stuff. the room for all of those classes, which is a shame. I wish <sighs> I, I could have done it. But it was a smell that I couldn't deal with. And there are kids frog shell. I have no idea because I don't really dabble in the frogs. But I kind of want like... Something that looks like it's like falling apart. Like mm. maybe even just the some of the werewolf stuff because... Let's have a look. Like maybe even like this desk here and we put some frogs on this, you know. Maybe we stack a table on top of it, for example, you know. Mm. So it's just all been like sort of shoved in the room. I need to do a little bit less than that. Could actually use a book, so it, like sort of sticks over the edge a bit. Like, what if we do something like this, and we put like frogs all over this kind of stuff? That's cool. I like that one. The bathtub from Strangerville? Oh, that's kind of a cool idea too. Just like, yeah, weird bits of furniture that stuff's just stacked on. It doesn't have to be like a table or anything. I'll just use move objects and put stuff on it. What else is in here? I like this. It's technically a sundial, but I might put some frogs on top of it. <laughs> a stump. Although that's a bit weird in here, maybe not. <laughs> Tire could work? Yeah, I'm just trying to think. I mean, it's a sewer, so anything down here would either have to have been brought down here or washed down the sewer in a way, you know? Hmm. Mm. I feel like we could do a chair that has stuff on it. Ah, oh, toadstool. How about like this chair? We can stack frogs on it. The rags of riches chair. I love that chair. It's a classic, that one. Uh, what else do we have? Where's the um, other ones from this pack? Hmm, is, uh, where are they? I cannot see them. Here we go. It's, oh, I was looking for a red chair, that's probably why. I might shove this like here. It's like sort of shoved in the corner and put some frogs on it. The baby bassinet. <laughs> that's actually funny. I have a bassinet with a frog in it. <laughs> uh, bassin. Oh, okay, that didn't work. Bat, bat, bass, net. Oh, I'm filtering by werewolves, right? Fair enough. Um, actually, wasn't there a werewolf? I thought there was a werewolf bassinet. Maybe it's not. Maybe it doesn't have bassinet in the title. Is that what it is? Where are bassinets? Are they miscellaneous? In beds. Oh, they are just in beds. Or in kids' section. I don't think they're in beds. My bad, kids' section. I mean, I don't know either. <laughs> Miscellaneous beds in oh here we kids go kids beds is what oh, I, guess I was nest. thinking of. I mean that maybe oh that's so cute Ew. it's like dirty it's so cute though it's nasty but yeah it's good though good nasty nasty or realistic nasty Nana's nasty enough. Oh, pallets. Yeah, that's a good one. 
Now let's go, oh no, let's go debug. This frog city is going to be popping off, guys. So let's have a look in debug. So there should be, oh, this one. Is this what people were talking about? Oh, it's a relic display, but this is definitely, this is what we need to for sure. This will definitely have some frogs on it. Frog City. <laughs> Dude, Frog City is lit. Should we have another exit from Frog City? Although it didn't seem like in the pop up we got that there was another exit. So maybe we don't need one. What rug options do we have here? Is there one that's like. No, no rug. Uh, what was I looking for? A pallet. A pallet would be good. Mm -hmm. It's in here somewhere. Maybe some just miscellaneous planks as well. I actually might just put some planks in the water. Oops. It might look weird though because I don't move, but they're floating. Here we go, pallet. Well, we're going to make the pallet smaller because otherwise it just takes up way too much room. I'm gonna, I'll get a couple out. Uh, maybe we'll do three and then I'll, I'll move the height when we put the frogs in. Oh my gosh, yes, fridge, with the frogs in it here. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> That'll be sick. <laughs> all right, this is looking, I think we got a good base. Let's get the frogs. Are all the frogs from base game? I assume they are. I don't think they added any others, today. I don't know if there's an easy way. I guess you could maybe type frog. It might actually come up if they're named. Oh, yes. Okay, frog fridge. Let's go. I'm just going to go down the line, basically. <laughs> so cool. I don't know if I can really... Maybe I could put another frog on top of this frog, because I can't really put it on that middle shelf because it's too small. Sort of stack them like that. Actually, it looks a bit. Let me move this one over a bit more. So wait. <laughs> now, for some reason, you can't actually place them on these shelves, which I feel like you should be able to because the shelves are huge. But we'll just use move objects. It's fine. So this is going to be a lot of uh, me pressing nine to move them up. But you know, it is what it is. It is what it is, and it is what it is. Exactly. You said it. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm getting lost where I'm up to now. Frog City is coming along. Do these make noises in the game, or is it just silent? Oh, they're definitely floating. Sorry, we'll move the shelf a little bit. <laughs> oh, that is really cute. Do you like my Frog City? Me too. I I more than like it. I love it. Would you move into my Frog City? I would. Let me put it on the chair there. <laughs> Aww. Which one's that? What am I up to? Striped leaf frog. Okay, this one. Oh, that's actually can be placed there. That's good because I was going to put it there anyway. Wait, is that that too? Yeah, it is. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> put some on top of the fridge. Well, hang on. I got to fill up the rest of the room. We're definitely going to have some repeats, but let's just go around the room and start. And then we can go back for a second pass. Pass. Uh, okay, let's get one here. And there. One in the middle. That's looking pretty good to me. Going up the top. Now, this is what I imagined when it pops up saying you're in Frog City. <laughs> <laughs> and I feel like we've really turned new leaf here like you know mm. like this is really made the whole tunnel system worthwhile really the has. frogs just wanted a place That's... and now they've got it see these move objects a bit more on the top here so i can sort of place them a bit better it's kind of hard because you have to avoid snapping it Ugh. come on Mm, I might not be able to move that one anymore. 
All right, I'll leave that one there. Move this one back. Maybe, yeah, it's kind of hard to get the edge ones. I guess I can move, hang on. Move that table. Yeah. And then we put it back. There. Cool. All right, we're looking good. What was that? What did we get up to? Tiger frog. Okay. Who's holding the frogs? I don't know. Probably Greg, I assume, because he isn't. Doesn't he love frogs? Apparently, he likes spell casters, which is quite interesting. The leopard frog. Like, apparently, if you're a spell caster, you can make friends with him. Hmm. Well, that was quite interesting, quite telling. <laughs> that one in the bassinet. <laughs> <laughs> frog City, yeah! Population Frog. Because the, the little pop-up says whoever's had all these frogs has been breeding them. And yeah, Greg likes to eat them, so I mean, I could imagine him coming down here to breed frogs and eating them. Mm. Makes sense. So what we're going to do here... This is probably where we're going to start getting into repeats, but that's okay. We're going to do like three like this. We're going to get another pallet. It's going to go on top of those frogs. I guess I'll move them forward so we can actually see them. <laughs> yeah, and then we go to the next layer. Wait, what did I get up to? I guess it doesn't really matter because I can just keep doing more dirt whirl. You know what was a huge disappointment? The frog scenario. Because mm. it was like... I was, that was rough. I thought it was going to be cool and fun. It was just a bit of a grind, to be honest. So I actually filmed a video for that that I never posted or edited. Oh, you never posted that? No. That was so funny, because we actually filmed it the same day. We didn't know we were both filming it. I'm like, oh, I just filmed it, and it was really bad. And you're like, I just filmed it too, and it was bad. Oh, I was like, I don't know. <laughs> this just doesn't seem like a good video to post. Yeah. I post mine anyway, though, because I have no standards, so... Well, that's really... <laughs> really <Good>. what? <laughs> I'm kidding. I have standards. But I just edited it so much. Like, this, I cut out so much of it, and then I've when I was halfway through it, I found you could just stand at the pond and just keep farming it. Yeah, yeah that's what I did, too. So, where did you get the pallets from? Oh, that's from werewolves. In Bite a Bug? Yeah, live edit. I mean, I think other packs have it too, but I just knew it was there, so it was easy to grab it. Yeah, now these kind of them. these kind of intersect the palette, but I don't really care. It's just for aesthetics, you know. You just look at it. Come check out all the frogs. It's pretty cool. I think it is very cool. Thank you. Let's do a couple at the top. <laughs> I wish I was. As Actually, cool you know what I want to do? I want to make it so these walls never go down. Mm. So I'm going to do a, a section that goes around the room that's just all platform raised up then it won't let you put the walls down. And it'll give you the full vibe of Frog City. But I'm only going to do it in this section. Whoa. I don't know if this is a good idea, I'm just trying it. It was a thought I had. A lot. So it means if you put the walls down, they stay up like that. Because then, then you can always see Frog City. I think when I go to live mode, does that disappear? Because that's kind of in the way. Oh, it might not. I guess it's not really on the wall. That's annoying. Might need to move that over there, maybe. Yeah, maybe let's move that. Whoa, lag. Hang on. There we go. Might put it on that wall, because that doesn't go down. And actually, it feels like that space a bit better, I think, so that's okay. Okay. So this is just one of the many rooms that this sewer is going to have. And that's pretty exciting. Well, I say many rooms, we might do two or three. That's a little bit fun. I want to build the room where in the lore it's like there's like a metal room and the door's been like ripped open. Like someone didn't want to be in there, there's like scratches all on the wall. That was That's a cool one. It's like someone was like locked in there or something. It's like a panic room almost. Okay, and then I might move the fridge. Maybe I'll swap the fridge with the chair because the wall is taller over here. 
Yeah, the spellcast room could be fun. I don't know if I'll do any more today because I've been streaming for three hours now. I mean, this is a lot of fun. I do actually want to keep going, but unfortunately we have like so much like renovation work coming up on the house that we actually have to do pre-recording. <laughs> so we have videos while we're, that's all happening because we're getting new floors put in, in like my office and Deli's office. So we have to move everything out. And they're like, we're starting on this day, maybe. And it might take this many days, but we're not sure. <laughs> and we're just like, great. Okay, cool. <laughs> Which, look, I know these things happen and they, they might not be out of control any circumstances, but it's, it's just a bit... That's why we just want to make sure we have enough videos for however long it may be. But maybe I, I could continue this in a video, maybe, is what I could do. And, like, finish it off. Yeah, what do we reckon of this? Having, like, sort of the wall up so you can kind of see it. I think actually maybe the fridge should be here. Yeah, I think I made a mistake. Because then, yeah, that makes more sense. Because it's kind of hard to see the fridge around the corner there. I think you should upload that to the gallery just as a room. No, no. This okay. is exclusive to this renovation. Oh. <laughs> you have to download the whole lot. Oh. But I feel like we've done some really good stuff here today. All right, that looks better. That's pretty cool. All right, well, what lighting do we want to do here? I've just done that at the moment, but I feel like we should have some more. We should have something else. Lighting. Hanging light bulb. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too, like the little dangly one. It's a classic. I don't know. What, it's so weird how expensive it is. It's always way further down than I think it is. It's like 150 bucks. Yeah, there it is. And I want to make it dimmer, I reckon. I think that's too bright. Should we have metal flooring in here instead of the concrete? Because it's like an offshoot room. What do we reckon? Like if we did that. I like that. And then we, we've got to scuff it up more. Let's get some like dirt and junk and all that kind of stuff too. Actually, I'm going to live mode and I'm going to... Let's do it now. Get color intensity this light. Ooh, should it be colored? Not like super colored, but like... Because it could almost be like a heating, someone put like a heating bulb in for the frogs. Like if we, not green obviously, hang on, so I color this light. It was like more orangey or like more, even like more warm colored. What do we reckon? Green, oh you do like the green light? Okay, maybe the green. The green or the orangey? Not, hang on, I'm going to turn it down a bit. Like that. That's the green. What do you reckon? I like the orange, but I don't know what's realistic for frog hibernation. Well, not this. <laughs> so <laughs> let's not try. We're but not they, trying to make they, it realistic. They have heat lamps, don't they? So maybe. Oh orange. yeah, but look, we're in a sewer in The Sims Four. Well, sewer. It's a pool in a basement. So you know, well, suspension of disbelief. It can be whatever we want it to be. UV lights are purple, orange. I I, I think I like the orange. I might change. I might change it to that. I'll always opt for warmer colors. I think. I think that's good. This light's also a bit weird here because it's kind of getting blocked by that. So I might move the position of it maybe to this side. Whoa, lag. There we go. Hmm. I'm just wondering what color this should be. Oh, actually, I should also change this to that. Yeah. Frog City, let's go! Let's go! Alright, let's get, um... Keep your eyes open for a frog in Frog City. Exactly, let's get some, like, stuff on the wall. You know, I kind of, I need more light for this. <laughs> it's nice and atmospheric, but I can't see what I'm doing. Let's just get some light while we decorate. Um, okay, what else? Oh, so we got, if our water pump is there, should we have like some sort of, there should be some sort of like pipe coming from the other side, right? Maybe like this. Oh, that's killing that poor frog. Maybe make it a bit smaller. I don't know where the pipe goes or what it does, but it does something and that's what matters. Um, and then we need some splodges and all that kind of stuff. Where's all the, the goop? 
Is that miscellaneous? Or is it just in, yeah. You're asking me? I'm just asking anyone. Oh. Anyone in chat could answer too. Some cobwebs. I don't think I want to do a rug. I don't know where that went. It just disappeared. Kind of feel like... I don't know if the rug would... I don't know if that would make sense. But then what might, What does make sense down here, I guess, is probably a better question. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is that too subtle? I guess actually I should make it too subtle because when we get rid of the lights you won't be able to see it anyway. So I'll make it a bit brighter. Yeah, I'll get some floor stuff too. Getting some cobwebs around the place. This needs something. Some cracks there. What is this anyway? Oh, like little scratches. That's cute. Well, I hate to love you and leave you guys, but what? The girl's got to do a workout. You finally gotten bored of hanging out. That's so sad. No, but I do have to do my workout, otherwise it won't get done. And then I need to film. Where are these splodges? And edit. These. And then I'll go to bed by the time oh, all it's that's in, done. Yeah. Okay. Well, good luck. I, I mean, I'm finishing up in just a minute anyway, because I'm just getting a lot. Ew. Well, it'll Green let, flog, frog splatter. Yeah. It'll let you guys have a little bit of alone time together. I don't want to interrupt, so I'll, uh, I'll be off. Bye. Thank you. Good building. Bye, everyone. Thank you. Bye. Love you. Love you more. Aww. And chat. Aww. It's really sad. She's gone. <laughs> okay, I kind of got it close enough to the wall. Yeah, that's good enough. Um, all right, that's looking pretty good. Oh, are those going to appear through the wall? And <laughs> that's kind of annoying. Get rid of these. Oh, we do need some junk though, like trash. So let's get that. And we'll just do werewolves, which will be, oh, actually let's get a floor crack too. That's probably a good idea. Floor crack, beautiful. Um, And then, no, not rubble, just like the, the junk. Okay, not that much junk. Just a, just a little junk, not, not like a lot of junk. Maybe like a trash bag or two. Okay. Now that's a frog city. <laughs> Have I considered placing the frog fountain somewhere in this room? I don't even know what that is. Frog fountain? Frog fountain. I don't know what that is. Is it just in the fountain thing? Uh, where are fountains? Uh, what is the frog fountain? This. No, that's a fish. That's not a frog. This one. Hmm. Oh, that's the wrong thing. Does this have like a... I kind of wish it was darker though, because it's a little colorful. We had rats. No, I didn't add rats. Um, actually, yeah, where do I find rats? Because we definitely need rats down here. Does it work if it's sized down? It's just a bit, I don't know if it really makes sense. It's cool though, I do like it. City living, okay, I'll filter by city living. And we could, <laughs> what does that look like? Cause it's gonna be spitting water, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> um, so city living. Well, we need we need rats. Let's get the rats in. Then we might wrap it up for today. Is it like a debug item or is it? I think it's debug, right? Because it's like a rat hole. Or can you just buy it? This is where I need glue on. Glue on nose. Ooh, paint cans. This is like a glue on thing. It does this in every build. Okay, it's not in show all, so maybe we have to do debug. Let me know if I go past it. 
Even though <laughs> there's delay and it won't really work. But let me know. Uh, great. They actually, they added actual rats in pets per gluon. What? Deep bug is just a wall decal. No, I thought um, rats actually come out of it though, don't they? Like in city living, they do anyway. I think it's actually just a wall decal. Well, let's just scroll through here. <laughs> See if we find it. It's definitely a city living thing though, but I just don't. Okay, I gotta go back up. I probably went past it. What is this? No. So if I just go wall decal, let's try that. Wall decal city living. Uh, I feel like it's not. Is it miscellaneous? Uh, painting? Uh, my debug cheats off. Cats and dogs? Oh, okay. Well, they definitely have them in the um, apartment, so I guess that's why people said that. Try cats and dogs. Okay, not in there. Um, okay, here. Realistic mouse family included. Okay. So this will give us, hopefully, some actual stuff running around, which we definitely want. There's another one in here. Let's see. So it does take up space, so in theory it should have stuff come out, right? Fast forwarding. Does it take long? <laughs> let's, go into, let's go into the Frog City, by the way. Let's check it out. Oh, Frog City. I'm exploring the tunnels. Yeah, Frog City! Sweet! What happens if I- can I sit in this chair? Will it let me? Oh. I was kind of hoping it wouldn't let me because it's a bit- it's a bit awkward. Hmm. Oh, okay. I can't sit in that one. I guess maybe there's something in the way of that one. Maybe I just need to block the chair. Ask for help cleaning. Oh, you're gonna need a lot of help. Hang on. I thought I heard something. Wait, is that just the frogs? No. I don't know what I heard. Thought I heard like a mouse or something. Okay, get off the chair, please. Thank you. Uh, let's put something in front of that, just so he doesn't sit on it. So wait, wait what's a frog chair? <laughs> Why are there so many frog items in this game? Is it like a chair? Oh, is that? Oh, this one. <laughs> That's why I don't know, because it's new. Um, I mean, I guess. It doesn't look dirty though, it's my only concern, but I guess we can use it. There we go. Oh, this chair is so good though. We need this. Okay, there's too many chairs in this room. Let's <laughs> we can put that somewhere else. Uh, let's get... I'm nearly done, I swear. I know I keep adding stuff, but... I just want something in front of that so we can't sit on the chair. Maybe we should just do a pile of rubble. I might size it down. Oh no, the size down doesn't work. Because if I put this oh my gosh, here. Uh, that looks okay. It doesn't look like it's kind of a too out of place. I darken it a bit. Now will that stop you sitting on this chair? Yes, good. That's all that matters. But you can, in theory, sit on the frog chair. <laughs> yeah! Now this is Frog City. Hang on. Oh, oops. Too far. Too far. Oh. It's really the, the ceilings that ruin it all, right? Like, I mean, look, look how clean and pristine that suburban home ceiling is. <laughs> Let's just aim downward. Now that is Frog City. <laughs> Get a good screenshot of that. <laughs> That's pretty good way. Let's have a look at the sewer as well. Oh no, that oh, this It's cool, but the ceiling really really ruins. Okay, let's let's just go slightly above the ceiling so you can't see it. There you go. That that gives you the atmosphere you want. 
So look at this. This is still work in progress. We'll um well, we'll do some more. Probably won't be live stream. I'll probably do a video of it. Like I was mentioning, we've got to do a bit of pre-recording, so I love this room too, old junky. The old junky storage room. Look at this place. Beautiful. Into the sewers. Now this is what I would have built if I could use cheats and every item from every pack. But, alas, we could not use cheats or every item. And this probably would not have looked as good uh, if I tried to build this without all that stuff. Also, I don't know why I've got a column there. I should probably just get rid of that, right? Because it's kind of a bit random. So I might get rid of that. All right, and then the other stuff, that wasn't all we did. I do like how dark it is down here, though. I don't know if that's annoying for players, but I like it. It's got a bit of atmosphere. Then up here, we did a little bit. We didn't We didn't go too, we didn't go too far. We did a few more things outside. Oh, see, look. This is what I'm talking about. This is why, yeah, this is why we didn't flood the room, because the water kind of just disappears every so often. But no, re oh, see, I can't even, I can't put it there. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, maybe we just don't have it. Bowser! Well, on that note, I guess the stream is over because Bowser is here. Where is he? He's just here. <laughs> is he going to come up on his chair? Uh, Bowser likes to sit on this chair. No, no, he can get it. No, Bowser, not through the arm. There you go. Up you go. Yay! There you oh, go. You're facing the wrong way. <laughs> well... Thank you everybody for coming to the stream today. Sorry that it wasn't the original plan. I mean, I did always plan to do the renovation, but we didn't get to have the special guest today. But we have two other very special guests. And stay tuned, because um, we will reschedule the other stream with the other special guest, hopefully. Fingers crossed. So, um, and I'll post about that on you know YouTube and, and Twitter and all that, and all the same places I did with this one. And uh, I will... I guess work on the build a little bit more and maybe do a video of it. So stay tuned for that as well. Thank you, everybody. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in another year's time on my next live stream. I'm kidding. Yay. It'll probably be before that. Oops, sorry, Bowser. I think I just poked your eye. <laughs> Alrighty. Thanks, everyone. Bye. An awesome day. Goodbye from the Delhi family. Bye.